敵があなたを私のもとへ導いた実に喜ばしきことだわこれぞ夜の祝福の恩恵よ普通ここは旅人さんお元気ですかというところでしょう暗黒の運命を背負った我が祖国夕夜浄土がこの世に帰還したわかように偉大で極秘なる天の啓示は我がしもべのみが知る特権を持つ私もそれを証言できます実はフィッシュルはメギストス教あ,あ本当にしょうがないですねまったく実は公女殿下は昨日町の外で火花騎士クレイとお会いになりました道中公女殿下はクレイに自分の人生を語り心優しき小さな騎士は殿下の祖国が破壊されたことを嘆き涙を流して尋ねましたへえその夕夜浄土って場所本当に滅んじゃったのもう一回作られたりもしないマジよ<笑>その誠意と思いやりに感動を受けたわ本当にじゃあどうやったら故郷は元通りになるのクレイに教えてお願いお願いクマラいいでしょう<笑>静寂の楽度と無類の競馬を私もこの手紙を見るまでは信じられなかったんですが Esteemed Princess of the Iman Nachtrike, I write to you, having heard from my young daughter that your kingdom has fallen. Is that from Alice? Hmm, I wonder what island is this. Can I do for you, Your Highness? Hey. <laughs> 運命のラクドへの道を探していただきます。道がわからないだけかよ。<笑>まあ、せっかく頼んできたんだから教えてやるよ。ひひ、おいらたちは。What's with the sudden movie? の仲間、運命の案内役だぜ。あ<笑>あ、um...。おい、お前も合わせろよ。Oh my god. Very well, I am the one whom has traveled here from beyond the stars. Oh my god. So, the game of Tsumugumono. Snatch Tabibito no Tojo. I can't do this. <laughs> It's cringe. Kurupo, Kurupo. Eto, Gin you yaro. So soon? Eh, Honto ni Kurunante, eh? さあ、座って楽しくおしゃべりしようよ。よう、旅人にパイモン。ちょうど噂をしてたところに現れるなんて、すごい偶然だな。<笑>まさに、人ごといわばむしろしけ。の言葉通りでござるな。人は同じ志を持つ者同士で集まるものでござる。旅人とパイモンはそのご友人と同様。お返しに。君にある物語を教えてあげるよ。あ、oh, here we go <笑>。あんちゃんは話し方が独特だな。銀融詩人はみんなそんな感じなのか。他の土地でも銀融詩人にあったが。お主のように面白い人物はいなかった。きっと想像力の差があったんだろうね。だから僕が二人に奇想天外な物語を教えてあげる。ほや。かつて。海の真ん中にはエメラルドのような島があるという伝説があったロド大魔王はそこで進化と幸せに暮らしていた生まれてきたドドコたちは水に飛び込んだ泳げる子もいれば波に流されてしまう子もいた後者はやがてモンドにたどり着き子供の良き友達となったドドコはモンドで新しい友達を作ったその名も火花騎士しかしそれに反対した大魔王は小さな騎士に島へ行って能力を証明するよう求めたそこで小さな騎士は一番大切な仲間たちを引き連れて風越え波越え海の真ん中へと向かったけれどそこに魔王はいなかった魔王は嘘をついてたんだ試練も炎も神門もそこにはなかった
魔女である母親が作った夏の世界それをプレゼントとして yeah, this is literally the summary of the first golden apple archipelago event 夏は愛の季節であり自由と息抜きの季節でもあるだからここに来る人たちは歌って踊ってどうか幸せに物語はここでおしまい。昨日、安心して。飲めない人向けに。ならば、それを一杯頼む。うむ。この色のものにしよう。どうなあ、おお、んちゃんが酔っ払っちまったぞ。風邪を飲んでたんじゃなかったのか。Like、ああ。な。なのでござる<笑>おい<笑>君たちも分かってると思うけどあの手紙は間違いなくアリスさんが書いたものだよ。Be with Klee? Oh my god! Oh! 爆発なんかしないよほら、That's a cute 待っておいて。これを使うと離れていてもこうやって話ができるんだ。Oh. Okay. ジョーモーさっきまで興味津々だったのに。He's fine. もう機械を逃して<笑>ならぬ。<笑>カズハのやつ、大人っぽいって思ってたが、ちゃんと新しいものに興味を持つ若者だったんだな。でも、どうやって行けばいいんだ縄文に集合して、全員揃ったら出発するんだ。<笑>カズハ、Hey カズハ、Wake up! We're going wandering! We're going on an adventure! You're going on a date with me anyway! Yeah, are you coming too? 僕は遠慮するよ。まだ仕事が残っているからね。猫の耳と尻尾を持った女の子に、競合店に勝てるよう、そこまで歌ってあげるって約束したんだ。Six fingers, Jose! ジョセがいる。あの子は、ハラペニョー、あのスピーク。屋上で歌えるから大丈夫。Oh、売り上げで相手に勝てたらお酒一ヶ月分をくれるんだって。今日こそは。Under level e i g h t s h e し、my god。運命に対峙する日。過去の恥、往年の憎しみ。ここにて。It is time for attribution. She just <laughs> unleash her inner dude. な,なんとかを下す。というセリフはお嬢様のキャッチフレーズではないようですが。ねじゃあ。違うの？私は。It's from the Luke。耳にして。どれどれ？ああ、本当に他人の口癖じゃないですか。Yes, it's the Luke's <笑>。おお、お前ら早いな。大してやるぜ。こいつらは稲妻の伝説的な浪人と D ユエの才能あふれる先駆ミュージシャンだ。よあたいは D ウェイの新鋭ロックミュージックといい天気それに楽しいことが大好きだきっとこのお嬢ちゃんがパイモンが言ってた異国から来た皇女様なんだろう見た目だけですごいってわかるぜそれからそこの帽子をかぶったレディ家族から最も博識な学者は大抵とんがり帽子をかぶってるって聞いたあんたもそうなんだろうんこの女みなずまのかえでからかずはみなにあえてこうえでござるこいつは武術にたけていて誰も耐えられない攻撃を受け流すこと
ができるんだぞそれに凡人には想像もつかないような速度で雷みたいに剣を振るうんだえそんなすごい人だったのどれどれんここれはあっ<笑> <I'm sorry, that's laughs> <笑>に行けばいいのか聞いてきたぜ<笑>伝説の大魔女から偉大なアドバイスをもらったんださあみんなオイラを見ろ Everything is fine Thank you for the foul Um wait <gasps> おいーこれがオイラたちの交通手段だうん<笑>なんだか急に行きたくなくなりました。<笑>ちょっとグオパーに似てないか。ああ、あずよ、道を切り開きなさい。先陣を切るのは私です。お嬢様は動かれませんので。メンズバラビーバラチェンドフライチキン。これはあのアリス様の創造物だぞ。そんな人の犠牲を払わなくていいから。<笑>一緒に来いそうでした忘れてしまうなんてまあいいでしょ like how do you get like get into that and then you s e k a i d into and maybe a little crowded うらいぞ誰か明かりをつけてくれよああウィッシュル私の髪を踏まないでください。ヘビじゃなかったの<笑>起き上がってきたぜみんな、気をつけるでござる。おおやっと着地したぜイェイ、we're back here! あ、ah, it's been a while! まあ、well, that's what! <gasps> 美しい場所でござるな。It's beautiful. I'm sorry. <laughs> 風と海。そしてこの穏やかさ。うむ風の匂いも心地よい。Oh, I missed this. Oh, it's been a while. It's been a year. Has it been a year since the Golden Apple Acropolis? Oh, Shinka Shoku. Korezo Watakshina Nagane Motomete Ita. Shikse no Rakuen. Sa Inga Shukets no Korin wo Mito do Keru no yo. 闇を支配するこの私が諸君を夢の扉へと導くわ<笑>さあ夢の扉へ<笑>大魔導士メギストス公女殿下のお恵みに感謝します私は今日ここにて夕夜浄土へ祝福を捧げますモナそれにあんたら一体よいいから合わせてくださいおおうこんな神聖な場所に連れてきてくださった公女様に感謝するぜ公女殿下このような旅の機会を設けていただいたことありがたき幸せにござりまする皆の喜びは私の喜びこのような天命を尊奉する機会に皆を招くことができて大変嬉しく思っているわこれより巡礼の旅に出かけ身をもって国土の命の海を感受する何せここはどうあっても私の魂の帰る場所なのだからあなたは水元素から生まれた高貴な人物と言われる割に魂の不純物が多すぎるお嬢様は泳ぎに関してはメギストス教がやや劣るかもしれないとおっしゃっていますあなフィッシュルあなたにはもう我慢できません普段あなたに合わせて芝居をするのは構いませんが天才である私を見下してはいませんか泳ぎであなたに負けるわけがないですよおお、お嬢様の闘志が燃えてきましたいいぞ
My God. Some of Chelsea. Look at the touch, Masha. Maggie's the skill. Anata got a king of a taxi me dominant. Some of Rocasa, clear cotton in other way. Mudaguchi, I used to cry. But she was put on a corocara. Will you get a market? Yeah, she can she can just sprint with her hydro sprint all the way. I'm betting. I'm betting my kidney for Mona. There is a Fatui stuck inside a shell on this side. What? How? What? When? Who? Why? She's a runner, she's a trackstar. Which one? Wait, that shell? That looks like a shell. Is it this one? Hello there. Ah, Shaisa! Fire! Through the small gap. That's the only opening. Ah! Oi! What is he doing? How? This is for curiosity purposes. Can I just? <laughs> no. Oh, she's too fat. Wait. Can we like sigh you that shit? Can't do it. I still can't get in. Geo Chanter Bracer. But eh, it is what it is. I'll come back for you later. One day. Has a hot. What the hell is that? There's a Fatui. How did they get here? It's a Fatui emblem. What are you doing here? How did they get here? I don't know if you can see it. I don't know if you can see it. I don't know if you can see why? What? Why? What? Nani? Why? Huh? Don't scare me like that. What? Tabibito, Paimon, Yudan wa kimotsu de gozaru yo. Oh shit. Kanari chikai. Keikai wo tsuyomere de gozaru. Bring it, Brittany. I am so genuinely confused. What is happening? いいぞ、帽子だ。早く起こせ。こいつ、なんだかあまり賢くなさそうだな。俺を引き締めるな。殴るぞ。うわ。でっかい怪物。うわ。やめろ。何しやがる。Oh no, another NPC! I am so scared, ああ。お前たち、この島で何するああ。ここは無人島じゃなかったのか。前か。いや、何でもない。別に教えてもいいが。知ったらもう俺に構うなよ。あれは俺の発明した新エネルギー装置だ。無人島に来たのはこいつの性能をテストするため、それだけだ。もういいだろ。答えないのならおいらたちはこいつの帽子を奪うぞ。<laughs> Men's crying in auto tune. Do you see the camera is out there? Butter bomb bomb, Bakudan. Travis Scott. 
おい行くぞことはそう単純ではない気がするでござるまたあちらの女子たちの機嫌を損ねないために、oh, 拙者から一つ提案があるのだが、oh. この件は当分の間心に留めておこう注意や警戒が必要なことについては旅人と拙者が責任を持って対応するつまらぬことに邪魔されないことを願うのみそうだ旅人一つ忘れてないか What? 近くで話そうぜお前もファデュイのことを気にしてるんだろ原油野郎からもらった爆弾のことを覚えてるかヤホーマッチシャミしてたよなキャッチテールの周りは猫がたくさんいるんだよオーナーがアレルギーの薬をくれたんだけどあまり効かなくてあっちってはあオイラたちこの島でファデュイと会ったんだなんか変だろファデュイってどこにでもいるんじゃない<笑>標準の手下は優秀だからねどこに出てきたって不思議じゃないよでもこんなとこに出てきたらオイラたちの休暇の邪魔だぞ何か手がかりはないのかファデュイの情報は入ってないよでも大丈夫さ僕は銀融詩人だけど必要ならいつでも連絡していいよあまり役に立たなかったとしてもおしゃべりしてあげるだけでも心強いでしょはっお前ってやつはよく冒険に行く君たちなら旅先でハプニングが起きても不思議じゃないさでも出会いの全てが危険ってわけじゃないだから怖がる必要もない風は陸を通り過ぎたら海の上も通っていくでしょ白い雲が浮かぶところには風もやってくる銀遊野郎がああいうんだオイラも変なことが起こらず旅が無事に終わることを祈るぜ友達との旅なんだ楽しまないとな Oh, we're done with the first act. If you go back to Mondstadt, you will see Venti on your rooftop. Oh my god! <laughs> Hello! Oh my god. He's actually. Oh, baby. I don't want to. Me every day, whenever I need to wake up. Uh, hit me. Ah. Oh, you went to sleep again. Oh, <laughs> Mega Is that a squirrel? The squirrel talks? Hello? Am I Snow White? Yeah. Do you think it's a The boat can talk? Wait, am I in The Legend of Zelda Wind Waker where the boat can talk? What, what, what is happening here? Did I got Isekai'd? Ah! Oya, Okitan d e s n e Sakuban Kara, Osoraku Shima Nomini. Fudan wa Mirarena, Kimiona Kokena, it's the damn for two weeks. Eh, Suichu Oyoga Torini. Swimming birds? Flying squirrels? Swimming birds? Flying squirrels? Swimming birds? Flying squirrels? Swimming birds? Flying squirrels? Swimming birds? そういったことがたくさんちらっと見える風景だけでもなんとなく違和感がありますなあもしかしてこの島の海洋生物は違うじゃないのかでもこんなことする動機がないよなコスチューム also represent their region 見てよ兄貴死ぬほど怖がってるみてえだぞそりゃそうだろう誰でも奇妙な出来事にあったら驚くさ The urge to like The squirrel into the water is just like. t a k s a n o f u n a n o i n i k o o Kakate Mitanga, Daremo Hanno Stekrenakata. You make a Genjitsuni Narua can I that or? Funet or listen of Kutoba that Kuni Wakarano Mari is. Ah! It's gone? Oh no. Whatever should I do? Oh, Lu means looks shocked. Ah, cutscene? Oh, wow.
Maple leaf? Is that Kazuha's domain something something? ゆうやちょうどは私の予言通り降臨した。諸君。これこそが新たな目視力だわ。その通りです。皆様、奇跡を目の当たりにし、想像の瞬間に敬意を表する時が来ましたぞ。万歳。万歳。万歳。ゆ
I don't <laughs> think this is a perilous maze. Perilous it's trail. Home. Roll Most credits. Curious. What secrets lie within this place? I shall surely uncover. Priorities, Kazuha. My son turned six this year. His name is Kazuha. Just as my wife wished. Aww. But like his parents are dead. So like that's sad. Rubber and that it is instead we who are young who are the key. Are we too young for this? Okay. Chest? I hear chest sounds. What the hell? Anyway. Oh my god. Oh, that's long. Eba Kadebra. No, Ebra Kadebra. What? Eba Kadebra? Oh. Oi! Ah! 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 No! Oh shit! Can't use in domains, are you kidding me? Stand by to dodge, why? Oh shit! <laughs> Another Omamori. The flesh resides in society while the heart yearns for the natural world. Such has been the way of the Kaidaharas for many generations. Kazuha, the future of this clan will one day be in your hands. When that time comes, remember to always stay true to yourself. Listen carefully, Kazuha. A Kaidahara blade is not forged for the purpose of harming people. Father, what are you carving? <laughs> it's a rock garden. I'm modeling it after the scenery I saw on my travels abroad. It'll go in my bonsai later. Work has been so busy these years, I've barely had a moment to spend with my grandson. I hope he doesn't take after me. When he's older, he should get out there and see more of the world. And he did. There's a chest here. Like the kings, the queens, the woo! Sorry, am I too short to reach there? What's happening? What's the one at the back? Woo! Azuha! <laughs> oh, there you are! Huh? Where did you all go? This place is a maze. We all got trapped inside except for you. I've been stuck in this room the whole time and can't seem to find a way out. I have to say, this place looks a lot like my childhood bedroom. Mm. If this is your home, why would you be trapped here? Is the maze trying to keep you out? It appears that this whole maze is modeled after my family home. And all the conversations you heard in there are in fact words once spoken by my father and grandfather. You said that the maze is trying to keep me out. Indeed, I'm the only one unable to explore this place. I think these unusual structures are some kind of mirage. According to what Kazuha said, all this seems to be constructed based on Kazuha's memory. Hmm. But why should Lord Kazuha be the only one excluded? Maybe that comes from me too. To me, what is past is gone. Everything in the world is guided by its own rules, and as for people, we can never relive the past. I think that this belief is the reason why the Mirage was keeping me out. Mm. Oh, I can get behind that. It's a very sensible way of looking at things. All our thoughts have consequences. I don't consider it strange, and I don't think it's anything you should be worried about. Hmm. We got in here by touching the bonsai, didn't we? So perhaps, if we touch it again... I... Oh! We're back! We're outside again. Hey, look! That whole mountain's changed completely! Wait. Eh? Oh! Everyone, 
I might have an explanation. The changes in the mirage could be related to the bonsai. My father once mentioned that this pot was originally part of a collection belonging to my great-grandfather. He adored his bonsai and always took great care of them. When our family fell upon hard times, my grandfather traveled far and wide looking for a way to save the clan. However, during that time, my great-grandfather became gravely ill. He knew my grandfather had no interest in bonsai, so before his death, he gave most of his carefully crafted bonsai away. This is the only one he retained. To hide the letter with that secret in it, right? Yes, and to give his son something to remember him by. My grandfather returned quickly as he could, but my great-grandfather had already passed away. They never got the chance to say goodbye to each other before the end. After that, my grandfather would spend long periods of time standing in front of this bonsai, lost in thought. Eventually, he started to make his own bonsai. Unlike his father, he preferred arranging rock gardens instead of plants. Perhaps influenced by my grandfather, my father also took a liking to crafting bonsai. Back then, our courtyard was filled with all kinds of them. And this flower pot was passed down to me as a family treasure. It's certainly no coincidence that it appeared here and became the entrance to the mirage. It's almost as if... It's giving me a chance to make up for past regrets. There was once a time when the Kaidaharas were an illustrious clan in Inazuma. After the Raiden Gokaden incident, our clan's fortunes took a turn for the worse. By the time of my generation, our downfall was complete. Later, I fled Inazuma as I didn't want to be arrested. With no one left in the Kaidahara clan, the authorities confiscated everything in our home, including this bonsai. Like my ancestors before me, I think I'd like to try it out for myself. Recreate a favorite scene from my travels and place it into this pot. Oh. Hmm. Why? Since the contents of this bonsai affect the mirage, I'd at least like to try my hand at making something. Wow, it's a new place! Oh, now Kazuha is gone again. As was the case last time, only Lord Kazuha is missing. What do you mean? Kazuha is here! <laughs> time to go! Oh, what the hell? Oh, no, no, no. Oh, wait. Oh, that's the Omori. Omori. Omori? Omam Omamori. Sorry. <laughs> Wrong game. Yeah. Oh, we're done. This will do. Ah, Kazuha. Oh. You've come just at the right moment. What do you think of this rock carving? It's very intricate. I based it on a mountain scene I saw in a book. You know, there are nations in this world where the mountains reach all the way up into the clouds. <sighs> if only I had the chance to see them with my own eyes. Father, you can go anywhere whenever you want. That's not true. Though the Kaedehara clan is far from what it used to be, I still bear all the same responsibilities Why does the, the, the dad clan looks like me. every other NPC? But then again, continuing in the way of our forefathers, sacrificing kind of like everything for a declining clan, he looks like any other NPC. Is it really worth it? But I... I don't understand. Kazuha, there's one thing I want you to always remember. Family ties are important. But you ought to not let them hold you back. Family only exists because of the people in it. If we are unhappy, how can we hope to build a joyful one? The events of the past... Reach! ...have had a profound impact on our family. But they are not your burden to carry. Mm. If you ever grow tired of this tedious life, just drop everything and go off on a journey. See the world. Remember, Kazuha, don't let yourself get tied down in life. Yes, father. Oh. I've heard a lot about you, Mr. Kayadehara. It's my honor to meet you today. <gasps> it is Kazuha's <gasps> honor. Kazuha! Get ready. Teamwork is dream 
Teamwork. Teamwork is team. No. Teamwork is dream work. My god, I can't. Ah! Fine. I need to <laughs> train harder. I really just one punched. Wait, one punched? What the heck is punched? Punched. For the area, you look for an exit, so. Oh! Doko, let's go. Oh, more Kazeda. Kokodayo? Oh, wait, what's that? Woo! Just. Uh, uh, I got jibated. I'm sorry, but I just don't understand. Kazuha, have you forgotten our promise? Do you really want to give it all up? But even if we're having a rough time, you still have me by your side. Can't I be of any help? When you were my age, you were already helping Grandfather out. Am I so incompetent that I'm a disappointment to you? Or... Kazuha! <sighs> now you're blaming yourself for all of this? That's why I failed you as a father. The Kaede Hara clan has been paying the price for our past mistakes ever since your great-grandfather's generation. To this day, we have never fully recovered from it. Though we are a family of bladesmiths, you don't have to devote your life to the family craft. You might think of this as a loss, but staying in the trap has far more deadly consequences. Enough now, Kazuha. As the head of the family, I failed to revitalize our clan. You never blamed me for not giving you the life promised to you by our heritage. And I'm grateful enough for that. All these generations of suffering. Let's end them today. From now on, live your life with no burdens. Don't worry. I'll carry the blame for abandoning our family business. Father. Please don't. You should not be to blame for not upholding our family name. Even if that day comes, let me share the burden with you. Let's just wait and see. Sooner or later, I will have to lead the Kaidahara clan. When the time comes, I'll deal with all our problems. It's actually kind of sad. Oh. Okay, but why is this Kazuha story quest way more immersive than his actual story quest? Hey. <laughs> Think oh you're shit! Tough enough to go against me? <laughs> hey, no response. <laughs> What's wrong? You scared? Did you really think it would be wise to pick a fight with the Kaidahara clan? Yeah, boy. <laughs> Just let me finish my cough. Yeet. <laughs> oh. Rainbow gems for sign, huh? Master. Okay, faster. The Kaidahara clan is no longer what it used to be. That's Kazuha's voice! Is he okay? Gee. Oh! Why can't he hear us? Looks like it's just an illusion. This isn't the Kazuha who came here with us. Why is his legs like so sunk deep into the thing? Like I can't even see his knees. Bro, you good? I used to be an adventurer like you. And then I took an arrow to the knee. Oh. Oh. Oh my. Uh, I can't move around. Maybe if I were more adept in the sword arts, I'd be able to share my father's burdens. <sighs> oh, this is interesting. This won't do. I'm getting distracted by family matters and making too many mistakes. Is he playing the harp? What's going on here? Wait, that's the Windbloom harp. What is it doing here? <laughs> what? I yearn to hear the song of Nightingale. My patient ears ready to attend. A veil of mist obscures the western skies. Into its midst, a silver moon descends. Oh my god, it scares me. How's <laughs> the to know one is fighting a losing battle, and yet never once falter. This shall be my father's legacy. Oh, we're done. Oh, we're back. Thought we might find you trapped here again. <laughs> yeah, it seems those are the rules. We entered that maze in the mirage again, but the scene was different this time. 
The mood was more deflated, and the place more humbly furnished. Yes, that makes sense. What you saw was the Kaidahara clan in decline. We saw you in the Mirage, too! But you look a little different than now. Compared to the Lord Kazuha before us now, the Mirage we saw appeared lost, with the burden of fate weighing heavily upon him. I can confirm that. His fate was a heavy burden indeed. That means I am older and wiser now. I'm sorry you had to see my less mature former self. It's okay. For a long time after leaving Inazuma, I've lived the life of a drifter. But this is no bad thing, because I learned much from the experience. I wish that I could have met my past self too. If he saw me, I know that he would understand. Life is a long journey. And that's why I must travel far and wide. What happened here? Jeez, Luis. Alas, the loftier the clan, the more devastating the fall. Broken into pieces and not a single soul around. This must be the way things ended. Man, everything is falling apart. Master, we're the only servants left. Are you sure about this? After we're gone, who's going to... Don't worry. I'll be fine. Your mother died early, and now that your father has left you, you're all that remains of this clan now. I suppose that this is the last time we will ever see each other. Master, please take care of yourself. Everyone, on board! Farewell. The Kaidahara clan has ultimately disbanded in my hands. But as my father said, I should not let life imprison me. Perhaps living the wanderer's life is what was meant for me after all. Hmm. Whoa, it's gone. What? What the hell? This is so bizarre. You know, they say that visions represent the Archon's gaze. Hmm. But is being under an Archon's gaze really a blessing? I don't know. Maybe? No! Is that who I think it is? Is that Tomo? Stop, stop, stop. I'm actually gonna get sad. Stop this. No! Oh, he's losing everything. I can't do this anymore. I'm done. I'm done. You're done. Hoyovers, you're done. What is a conch doing here? I can't do this anymore, chat. I can't. I can't. Uh, I'm still in my tomocopium. Hoyovers, please. I know I know he's dead, but like you did the same thing with Honkai. Please, please make Tomo playable. Please. I don't care if he's dead. He make us alive anyway. In the Honkai. Why can't you do the same Genshin, huh? Oh, it's not that hard. Oh wait, there's the conch here, Nani. Oh, and a chest! I have traveled far and wide in Inazuma since leaving home, and seen many new things along the way. Though material luxuries have not been a feature of my journey, it has yet been a rich and rewarding one. With the boundless earth and sky to call my abode, and all the wonders of nature as my partners in poetry. Vision Hunt Decree! Hand over your visions now! This way! Hurry! I can't do this anymore. Uh, no! I can't! Oh, Chaz. Time to go. <laughs> she ignores Tomo Porch. <laughs> I'm coming, Tomo! <sighs> He's guiding me. He's guiding us. No other option remains. I will leave. Oh, oh, we're fighting. The almighty Shogun is holding a duel before the throne. Unauthorized personnel are strictly forbidden from coming near. Wait, the kid has a vision? Get him! Don't let him get away! You know what? I'm gonna just solo Kazuha. Revenge! Run with nature. Follow me. Adorn my knight! Oh, guys, he gives me the Electro. No more! <laughs> He gave Electro to me! Another one? Cringe. 
I'm gonna fight them off for you, Tomo. Yeah. <laughs> Bye. Let's go, Tomo. Hand in hand Time with your go. bestie. Hey, bitch nugget. How's our support? Who does that? How's our carry? Let's go. Yeah. Oh, what? There's more. You may be buffed. You ain't, but you ain't buffed like Tomo. The life of a wanderer is full of hardships. I have asked myself these questions many times. Wait, where's Tomo? Should I go? If so, where to? And by what means? Wait, where is he? He's gone! No! Bring him back! Please bring him back. He's not gone. Okay, he's here, he's here! <gasps> Diane on my high as Nakuweed level copium. That's my lucky day! On Tomo. One with nature! No, he got trapped! The audacity! Oh, that's beautiful. Look at it. Just us together. And sometimes I look in your eyes And that's where I found the glimpse of a... Oh shit, I thought I was gonna fall. No! Okay, oh my god. What is it, Tomo? Tomo Dachi? Aww. It's giving me a chance. What? That's... <laughs> that's it? No challenge? Okay. Oh my god, there's more. This is a Kazuha only go. gameplay. Let's go! To commemorate Tomo. Oh, that's a ship. Off the fisher on the. Woo! Tomo! Tomo, you don't have to. But thank you. Okay. Oh, wait. Oh, he's not gonna follow us anymore. Come with me, please. I can't even take pictures with you. What the heck? Mm, I'm gonna miss you, friend. My best of friend, though. Kadahara, that's you, right? Get on board. I'll get you out. But why are you helping me? I'm a wanted fugitive. Obviously, the Yashiro. <clears throat> An anonymous financial sponsor wants you to get out safely. But there's only so much they can do. After this, you'll be on your own. Oh. My grandfather once traveled to Liwe. Well, my father read about Mondstadt. But... Where is the right place for me? The sky's getting dark. It looks like it's going to rain. Will the rain ever stop? Goodbye, Tomo. I'm gonna miss you, friend. Goodbye. Best of friend, though. Oh, shit! <laughs> Bro, I was getting emotional. <laughs> Goodbye, Tomo. We shall see you again. In the afterlife, that is. Unless how your verse makes you playable, then. Oh. Stop! I'm warning you! Do not attempt to My resist! My god. <laughs> oh, really? Train harder. What is more? Fallen leaves. Adorn my knights. Strike first. Bring it on. Hey, buddy. You okay? Need a ride or something? <laughs> Pirates. <laughs> you could call us that. So, you coming or not? You don't say. Oh, and look, Kazuha's over there. Where? How can you see him? Oh, there you are. Kazuha, we found you. Yeah. Ah, uh, good timing. I was just reflecting on my life so far, and I think I'm all up to date. So, what do you think of the Kaidahara clan's bonsai? <laughs> Indeed. Oh, this mirage is quite fascinating. It presents life like a stage play, with each scene more captivating than the last. They say that astrologists have seen it all. So if this mirage intrigued you, 
That says it was a worthwhile encounter. <clears throat> How fares thy mood? What? Main Fräulein inquires as to your present well-being, Lord Kazuha, hoping your heart is not too filled with sorrow. There's no way anyone could be cheerful after reliving all that. You, yeah, <laughs> You have a point. Thank you all for your concern. Fortunately, all those things are past and gone now. When I first saw this bonsai, I thought of the possibility that I needed to wait for you. Perhaps that was why I had to be here on my own. There was supposed to be a dead plant in that flower pot. However, there was nothing there. While we were separated, I had a lot of time to reflect. I think I finally understand now. The mirage is me. The empty flower pot represents the state of my heart. When the heart is clear, the world is too. And when the heart is unladen, the same is true. Clear and unladen. That describes how I feel right now. Although I would not say there are no regrets in this. To be unladen is also to be empty. That's why this bonsai appeared as part of my mirage. It gave me a chance to fulfill my wishes. I never realized that deep down in my heart, I also wanted to make my own bonsai. Perhaps this is what it really means to keep Kaidahara traditions alive. Have you finished doing what you wanted to do, Kazuha? Yes. You could say that. You saw my past self and said goodbye to him. Only when you witness my whole story does it become truly consigned to history. What really matters in life is not how strict we are with ourselves, but the connections we make along the way. There's no future for those who linger on the past. So please believe me when I say that I've already come a long way and I intend to go further still. I will always treasure your support. I often travel during storms, which means well, my Naruto eyes are already. often blinded by the rain. Many times, I couldn't even see what was right in front of me. One day, I finally reached the top of the mountain. I looked out with the clouds beneath my feet and only the gentle breeze murmuring in my ears. The highest mountain is a clear and enlightened heart. Here there is no self, no hatred, no regrets, and no desires. Let's embark on a journey, for I am the breeze. We will meet again, no matter how far along the road. Life has just begun, and maybe the whole world can be my home. be exhausted. Let's call it a day. <sighs> What's wrong? You don't look too good. Nothing. Perhaps today's arduous journey is making me feel slightly out of sorts. Hmm? Main Fräulein, are you alright? Oz, curb thy curiosity. Uh, yes, Oz, a weak old bird. Something for us to eat. I think I know why Fischl acts that way because once it's her turn of the domain, it's gonna reveal her past. Her highness looks kind of gloomy. Mona, you two seem close. Why don't you keep her company for a while? You noticed it too. I was going to bring it up with you while we were preparing the food. In that case, yes, just leave it to me. Hmm. Well, then, as a trusted friend, I have something I'd like to talk about. Oh, yeah. From what you've been saying, that miraculous mirage seems to have been based on my life story to date. Oh my God, besties at the back. It felt just like a dream to me. In other words, you've always wanted to make your own bonsai? Could that be it? 
All that was a means of granting me something I wished for? And since this happened to me, does that mean it could happen to everyone else too? I agree, but I wonder whose mirage we'll encounter next. <laughs> I'm actually kind of looking forward to my own mirage if it's a dream come true like you say. Wait, you actually want something like <laughs> this to happen with you too? What's it being depressing? Oh, heck, any mirage to do with me would probably be music related. <laughs> It'd be a good chance to showcase a few tunes. You mean you'd want to do a performance in there? I don't see why not. Why not? I don't think any self-respecting musician could stay silent on these islands. Just look at this place. Oh, um, uh, Traveler, Paimon wants to try some of the fruit growing on that cliff over there. Uh, we're <laughs> talking to Venti again. So, those strange houses today, huh? And, uh, a mirage bonsai? Basically, lots of weird stuff today. Um, do you think we should tell Venti about it? I mean, we're already up there, so like, might as well. There's no answer. That's weird. Why is he ignoring us? Man's drunk from all that drinking, dude. Maybe what else? he got distracted. <gasps> or he forgot to bring the bomb to his performance. <gasps> or he got drunk and fell asleep on your Most well, probably the latter. Traveler, Paimon, so here you are. Mona! <laughs> are you all done chatting with Fischl? <laughs> Close enough. She was a little downcast. I think it has something to do with the mirage we saw today. Fischl has been very excited about this trip from the start. But I have a feeling she doesn't want to see her own mirage. I've been saying. Why? It seems like this would be the kind of thing she really enjoys. No, she will not. I tried performing a divination again on the beach. My scry glass was still blurry, but I felt a force coming from within. I couldn't see its exact position, but I knew that it was changing. How could you tell that if you couldn't see it clearly? Hmm, how can I explain this concept to non-experts? <laughs> how do I explain oh, this I concept know. to these dumbasses? It's dumb like we're uh, sitting in a room and there's a crack in the walls. I need to see the crack first before deciding what to do next. You're surrounded by all kinds of friends, secrets, and destinies. It's incredible. No, <clears throat> you're incredible! You helped Fischl and us solve that first! situation <laughs> what is this uh keanu reeves you're amazing no you are amazing i'm Aww, not all the time i'm starting to like you a lot genius astrologist mona yes that's the perspective i'm talking about you'll never meet another astrologist as clever and charming as me <laughs> i'll keep observing the stars keep in touch traveler oh oh we're done oh he's so pretty oh my god うん。あ、大体と一緒に行動したくないみたいなんだ。冒険者協会から他の仕事が入ったって言ってたぜ。それ明らかに嘘じゃないか。遊野城道を復興するために来たって言ってたのに、なんでまた冒険者協会の仕
まだ見えませんおいみんなこれを見ろこれはスズミと言うべきかそれとも植物って言うべきか植物でできた楽器であるかふむ深淵ここはもしかするとあなたに関する島ではありませんか I mean, who else loves music? じゃあ Here. これはあたいのために用意された楽器か<笑>それなら早速打ってみようかな<笑>ボンまたれよ昨日は拙者がボン系の月山に触れると皆が特殊空間に移動したでござろう心配いらないぜあたいは音楽にかけては常に準備万端だからなボンクこっこへ<笑>大丈夫かパイモンあ、シースヒアやはり場所が変わったシンエンここはあなたに関する元凶なんでしょそうだと思うんだけど変だななんでこんなに荒れてんだ見ろあそこすごく明るいぞオイラたちを誘ってるみたいだうむ、行ってみるとするかいやいやいやどう見ても罠だろうそれはそうですが他に道もありませんしそれにもしこれが深淵殿の元凶なら罠などあるはずがない嬉しいぜこんなに早く値を認めてくれるなんてさあ、そうだよ、どうやって行くのあ、どうやって行くのあ、どうやって行くのあ、どうやって行くのあ、Why did I do that for? <laughs> Release sound waves that will cause any melodic blooms within an AOE to fire notes. Change the flight direction of the notes. Huh? I don't get it. Hold on. Oh. And then. Oh, so I sh. Okay. I got it. I got it. I got it. I think. I think I got it. I can get this. I'm an adult. Yep. Genius Alice strikes again. Let's go. Oh yeah. I wonder what this is. Tobira ni kagi ga kakatta. Enryo shite o ko. Shien, nande Tobira ni kagi o kaketa nda? Ah ha ha. So o kikare temo. Atai wa iye no mae ni aru ueki bachi no shita toka ni kagi o oku yona ningen da kara. 近くに鍵があるはずなんだけどおおじゃあどこかに植木鉢があるんだな I saw a chest Alright, bye Starfall あ What was that? Man's just turned into Michael Jackson for a moment there Is she an art who? You've been struck by You've been done by Let's move criminal Oh Oh, that's a sad melody, actually. Oh, that was easy. That was a fighting melody. Uh, I hear battling music. Yes, this is this is the Theater Mechanicus soundtrack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, we playing Theater Mechanicus again. Please, my brain will not handle this. Yeah. Oh, I thought we'd get few more gems. <laughs> Stop. Focus, Al. You must stay focused. Brothers. Have your brain ever handled anything? True. <laughs>
か暑いですねあの花と何か関係があるんでしょうか<笑> It's a pyro. まさかここに客が来るとはうわああんたはここの主人かここは音楽の殿堂私はただの門番に過ぎない友よそなたたちも究極の音楽を求めに来たのかその通りさそれではそなたが音楽に託すものはあたいの歌は反逆の歌だあおお素晴らしいそなたとは分かり合いそうだ出会えたことを幸運に思うしかし殿堂に入るためには私の歌声が必須 Yes, I can see how dry you are. Damn. Does it look like it's alright? <laughs> she knows. I don't know. 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 I don't k 探してきてやるよ<咳>泉の場所を教えてくれるか澄んだ水で育った植物は困難を乗り越え山を登る泉は緑豊かな山の上だ観山観戦はこの辺りの山にあるはずでござる探しに行こう待ってくださいどうして地下なのに光があるんですか It's a sea snake Snake I hate snake Oh, they're playing catch. Oh, look at them. What? I am so. Oh! My god. Genius Al strikes again. Mina, Koko ni Kakitske g a r So cute. Oh no, that's a long ass note. Oh. <gasps> oh, I don't mind reading it already. <laughs> P.S. This sheet of paper has been alchemical, alchemic, alchemically. Treat it to the wall to be able to not worry about the veracity of these notes, just enjoy the music and scenery. Sincerely, my husband, <coughs> I mean, Albedo cried a prince guy. I see, it's Albedo. Albedo is so good and can just see Nanda. I smoke on a shimani kitakoto garukara. Not any curish to that's not a many. Koreo no costan janaika. Oh, got it at the car. Wait, Kazuha met Albedo before back at Iridori Festival. Did he not remember? Where do I go from here? Um. And what is that? Oh, okay, I have an idea. I'm gonna make it burn. And then I burn myself with it. And then. Oh my. Nice try. <laughs> That's my dumb bastard, you're doing the work. Yeah. あるならば試してみるとよい<笑>えいやいや私は歌を歌えませんから万が一聞かなかったら恥ずかしいじゃないですか<笑>モーナの声は綺麗だから歌に向いてるぜもしよければ拠点に戻ってから歌う時の呼吸法を教えてやるよえほ本当にいいんですか絶対に笑わないって約束してくださいね We are gonna hear Mona sing. 笑ったりしないさ泉の水をアルのもとに届けようぜ<笑>浜辺にある鼓に触れれば元凶に入れるでござるもう一度やってみるとよいはいこれ完
This is your holy water, you dry ass flower. That flower is gonna turn into a Regis vine. The pyro wanted that. We're gonna fight it. I don't trust you. You're gonna turn into a pyro Regis vine. I can feel it in my belly. What the heck? あの鳥たちは山頂にある泉の脇水を飲んだから美しい歌を歌えるようになったんだよ。うちに歌うのが好きな人は一人もいないんだから、あんたも歌が上手なわけないでしょ。だったら歌いも、その水を飲めばいい
あたいをごまかせると思うなよもちろん冗談ではござらんロックは人に強い意志を与えてくれるそれだけで十分であろうほうハズワロックンロールデビューレッツゴーおや Uh, what's a sassy lost sassy child doing there? No, I'm not a bit of this. 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 もう一度よく見てくれ。立った二つ結びにとんがった髪飾り。そんなの捨てる人いないよ。だから変だっていうのは違うぞ。他の人と違うから、きっと印象に残るだろう。そしたら、今度また会ったとき、あんたはあたいのことを覚えていてくれるかもしれない。うん、確かにそうだ。髪型や服、それに顔やスタイルは、他の誰かに見せるためだけのものじゃないぞ。自分がしたい格好をしていいんだ。本当？でももし俺が犬の書いてある服を着たら、きっとフェイは犬みたいってからかわれちゃうよ。そしたら、そいつらの言うことなんか聞かないことにしようぜ。あんた、犬が好きなんだろうん、好き。あんたの友達は犬が嫌いなのかみんなも好きだよ。だったら、あんたの友達もきっとその服を気に入るはずだ。分かったでもお姉ちゃんなんでみんなに好かれるような髪型をしないの ?Just let her do what she wanna do her hair, my god. こういう個性的なのが好きだからな。はあ、それにこの髪を言ったときはみんなからこんなに嫌われるとは思わなかったんだ。なのに変えないのこの髪型こそがあたいの音楽と生活に合ってるんだ。普段よく見る髪型っていうのは。みんな普通すぎて元気が足りないそれにライブの時に髪が邪魔で頭を触れなくなっちゃうぜ嫌われても気にしないさあたいは変えないお姉ちゃんの髪型友達にも嫌われてるのそんなことないぜ綺麗だってみんな言ってくれる友達はお姉ちゃんの味方なんだな羨ましい俺の友達は俺一人をここに置き去りにしたんだえ<笑>急に泣き出してどうしたんだ何があったほらお姉ちゃんに話してくれルルとモンちゃんが俺と遊んでくれない<笑>今日は不当で会うって約束したのに二人とも来てくれないんだ子供のくせにすっぽかしかよここで待っててくれあたいが探しに行くよ二人を見つけたらあんたのところに連れてきてやるからさうんありがとうお姉ちゃん髪型が変だなんてもう言わない、yeah, you better be. <笑>気が利くなじゃまた後で、hey, kid. モンちゃんルルなんで遊んでくれないんだよあ、oh, there goes my childhood trauma、oh. Uh, I don't need this call out.、Uh, okay. Hey, kid! You don't just lose another. You don't, you don't ditch your friend like that. What an ass. Fate, the girl, who told the aunt of Matter, is all. Magic tabulated. Now it's my turn, though. Eh? Fake no yatsu. Nante Bacananda. No, 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 you're dumb. My God. Do you have a childhood memory? Yes. Mostly, they are mostly bad. Very bad. Very lonely, very depressing. You c a l Yes. Fate to Fto de out the Axocustaro. Nanda, I need the Aranda. I t night it as a eh? No, Paka. Cotini Kitakura, I got the money. Surprise, mother, yo is done the color. Surprise? Do you go to the Paka, Paka? What does that? サプライズを用意してたのに結局こっちに来てくれなかった上にな泣いたりしてごめん俺はバカだあうんフェイ君はバカじゃない私たちが悪かったの
フェイ君を驚かせたくてフェイ君今日は君の誕生日だから僕たちはサプライズでフェイ君を驚かせようと This reminds me too much of my old days No <laughs> それって I can't do this <laughs> フェイ君のためにハスの家宅をたくさん取ってきたよとっても美味しいんだからそれにこれは僕とルルが書いたお祝いの手紙字が汚いとか一個なしだよ<笑>ありがとうそういうことだったのか大事なくてよかったでござる友達だったらこういうことをしてもおかしくないよな友達がサプライズしてくれたらあたいだってびっくりするよサプライズを用意してくれって言いたいんですかすごい話術ですね<笑>おいよいよ違うぞただ感想を言っただけで分かってますよ私もちょっとサプライズで冗談を言ってみただけですああ Someone farted? What is happening? Oh, you heard that? Oh, it's a rum? Okay I swear I heard someone's farting I was like, the fuck who? そうだなあたいのうちで食べていけよここからそんなに離れてないから歩いていけばすぐだ Oh no, we gon' fight. Oh no. <laughs> we gon' throw hands. Isa. Ayo. Kokoda. Sa. Kokoda yo. 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 Oh, oh, shit. 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 そんな可愛い顔してこんなことするなよな頼むからあらそのようなことを言われても私は納得しませんよ外国の商人からおまじないを教えてもらいましたよねああ誕生日に願い事をするってやつだよなそうですそれです外国ではケーキにろうそくを立てて切り分けるそうですが私たちはシャンリンさんの料理を運ぶだけで精一杯でしたのでケーキケーキ頭の中で想像してみましょうでしたら12の3でぜひ願い事をしてください。I might farm a bit, I think. 1、2の3。うん。うん。今年は何を願おうかな。あたいの願いは。あ、あれ？戻ってきた。どういうことだ？おいらドアの隙間から中を覗いたばっかだったのに。元凶ってことは、シンエ、先ほどの部屋で何かありましたかあ、おいら知ってるぞシンエの誕生日を祝ってくれる友達がいたんだよなそれは私も聞こえてましたよそうではなくて、彼女自身のことを言っているんですあたいああ、あたいは願い事をしたけどそういえば、面白い話だったなさっきドアを開けた先にあたいの親友のシャーとウンキンがいたんだよ。Oh、あれは現実ですでに起こったことだ。前回の誕生日のことなんだけど、あいつらがうちに来て、あたいを驚かせてな。Um, 美味しい料理がいっぱいしてあって、あたいに、親友、その願いは何ですかあたいの願いは、思いもよらない人と一緒にライブをしたい
だ思いもよらない人誰であろうか答えを言う前にまずは山石を貫く水脈を開通させよう。Clear the water, OK. あ、uh, mm, uh, 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 okay, that's a lot. Uh, uh, 島の中に植物や水脈を失ってる山があるんだけど、それらを復活させる方法を知らないかそれなら、力になってくれそうな花を知っておる。この上に仲間の氷風の心が住んでいる。彼女に聞いてみるといい。ボンバイア。Oh. oh, what the hell? Isa, it's a cryo regis vine. Anata Tachi, it die nani mono? Atai Tachi, Shimano Yamani are the swing echo kaitu sasetakte. Anta no tsukara o karita inda. Yamao. ああなるほどあなたたちも大音楽家になりたいのねだったら私たちは同じ志を持つ仲間ねたとえ私の力がかすかなものであろうともあなたたちのためになるならいいでしょう私の花びらを取って旋律の交わる先に埋めてみてちょうだいそうすれば地下に沈んだ山脈が音楽を響かせようと勇気するはずよしこれでいいでしょうおわお感じたわ太陽が照り海が宝石のように輝き波がクリーム色の砂浜を打つ様をリズムを奏でているどんどんどんどんと音楽だ音楽そういえばこの島そのものが巨大な楽器だったわね潮風や波の花潮の満ち引きが奏でる音楽はこの世界で一番ロマンチックなもんだみんなあたいのライブを聴いてほしいついにこの時が来たぜみんなあたいは前思いもよらない人とライブしたいと願ったそして今日その答えをこの島で見つけたそれはかつてこの島を巨大な楽器に変えた人だ名前も顔も知らないけどそいつは間違いなくテイワットで最も偉大な音楽家の一人だと思うベンティまさかこんな楽器に出会えるなんて思わなかったぜ潮の満ち引きを利用して音を奏でるなんてないやこの音楽はソウルメイトへと送るもんだからな原住民に合わせた方法で合奏するつもりだ今日はロックじゃなくて新しいもんを見せてやるよおや That's new おカツインえー、えええええええあーベイビーシーニャンおーマイガーシーズプリティーヘッドダウンカッコを生きるあんたがこの画像を気に入ってくれますようにあーですビューティフォーどうだなかなかいい響きだったろええ、素晴らしかったですかような音の調べ聞いたことがない実に興味深いものでござったそれになんだか上品だったなこれであたいの願いも叶った他にやりたいことはないのですかあねえな今夜はぐっすり眠れそうだみなこれでしばらく時間が空いたと思うそこで一つ提案があるのでござるがパデュイの拠点に行ってもう一度状況を確認しようと思うのだがどうでござろうおやあなたたちもファデュイの拠点を見つけていたのですかふむまさかお主も私は天才先生術師ですからね<笑>それに前にも言いましたが水浦の番が少し回復してきています今なら占いで
ここの状況を感じ取ることだってできますよえここにもパティがいるのかええそれから今日フィッシュルと別れる際にこのことを伝えておきましたから彼女の心配はいりません仮にファデュイに遭遇していても身を隠すでしょうなるほどそれではこちらも情報を共有しよう奇妙な装置に取り乱すファデュイそれがあの元凶と関係しているということでしょうか断言はできないだが全く無関係とは思えぬでござるよ確かに可能性はあるなな,なら早速拠点に行ってみようぜおっしゃい島にいるのは魔物だけでファデュイがいないぞ駐留していた痕跡や装置はまだ残っていますが誰もいませんまあいいです占ってみましょう。There's one at the back. Oh, it's far. Oh, it's hella far. Need more jams. Nice. <laughs> Me. <gasps> Michelle, she's here. Oh! Wait, wait, wait. Uh. It says in Dilber Entelag. Uh, I need to activate this strange waypoint. Yes. Thank you. Okay, that's all. I shall return to you, Princess in the Antelope. Suita de Gosarna. Or it? Fisher? おおやお久しぶりですうんそんなに立ってないと思うけどあそのお嬢様と私はある気配を察知しすぐさまこの地へと駆けつけたのです皆様が来るのを待っていたところ思ったより早くご到着されたのでなんかオズのやつ緊張してないかオイラの気のせいかな雄也浄土の到来を目前にして私は祝福の儀典を準備しなければならないお嬢様また一人で行動できるわオズもし深き夜の襲撃に延期の女王を抱いたのなら白日に燃え盛りし光へと引きなさいお嬢様そのようなお言葉を私に言わないでください私はあなたの従者であり目でもあります決してお嬢様から離れることはありません詮索するような目で見ないでちょうだいととにかくまだ説明をする時ではないわお嬢様皆様申し訳ございませんお嬢様は機嫌が悪いようでしてどうかお気になさらないでくださいそれでは失礼いたしますはあ、別行動を取り始めてからずいぶんと経ってるのにまだ機嫌が悪いようですねフィッシュルの様子を見た感じこの辺りに現れる元凶は彼女と関係があるのかもしれませんうむ拙者と関係する元凶に近づいた時もかすかに親しみのある気配を感じたでござるよあたいもだ理由はわかんねえけど。何か面白いことが起こりそうな予感がしたぜええフィッシュルとオズが何かを感じ取ったということはその予感も当たっているということです自分の元凶と向き合いたくないからフィッシュルはあんなにイライラしているのかもしれませんね多分彼女の元凶には
他の人に知られたくない秘密があるのかもしれません皆さん一旦ここで休みましょう元凶が現れれば謎も解けるはずですあっえっ Nothing's happened. You're awake? <laughs> Then let's bring you up to speed. We searched everywhere and found nothing unusual at all. Based on the previous two mirages, we should have been able to find something that acts as an entrance. Is it possible that the time has not come yet? You mean we should wait a little longer? Yes. Plus, Fischl is still nowhere to be found, and I highly suspect that she's even more eager to find the entrance than we are. So? Let's wait. Let's give the Mirage. No. Give Fischl some more time. There's something on the beach! A book. And next to it is. Hmm? A raven statue? Hymn of the Holy Land. I. I've never heard of a book by that title. From the cover? It looks like it was written by Fischl herself? Fischl's still not back. Never mind. Let's head inside first. Once Fischl finds the book, I'm sure she'll be able to catch up with us. Though this truth has long faded from popular memory, scholars have long known that Prinzessin Fischl von Luftschloss Norfedort first descended upon the world during the time of chaos, roughly 600 years before the era of the saints. What? A narrator? From Stanley really Parable? Are inside a book, huh? There's even a narrator telling us the story. Oh no! The path has been cut off! We can't go across! The princessin harbored much sympathy for all living things and wished to never see them in pain. She harnessed the power of darkness and dreams to weave the night and gave it the task to safeguard all living things. Oh dear. Just the night ravens. Oh. Oh. Yes. The people celebrated and worshipped the princess's authority and followed her call to migrate to the sacred land that would eventually be known as the Immer Nachtreich. It really oh. is the Immer Nachtreich! Yo, so cool! Really looks the part. I'm quite impressed. Oh god, it's so pretty. Oi. Nice. <laughs> oh, in the ever loving dude, I'm already blind enough. Like, what the heck am I supposed to do? Can I just Kazuha myself and then, you know? You know what? Okay, I'm gonna just do. do. the thing. I need to big chain this. Frickety, frackety. Come with the bee. Okay, I can do that. One with nature. Climb up. Yes. Big brain. Ah, shite. So. Into the wind. No. Fuck that. I'm not using that. What the heck? We no. established a nation on the holy land, revered the princessin as the absolute one, and introduced poetry, theater, and adventure to the kingdom, laying the groundwork. For the inner not right. Well, I definitely can. Yeah, you know what? This. I don't have time for that. So the wind knows me. I'm not gonna make it. I'm not gonna make it. Shit, Kaza, I need your E now. Now, okay, one, two, go. When the rain no. finally ceased. The princess and descended from the palace steps <laughs> as to allow all her retainers to behold her unparalleled glory. Hey yo, I'm kinda smart, not gonna lie. 
<laughs> I'm actually smart. Help! Help! That was a cry for help! Who could it be? This is some Bioshock shit. Uh, chest. Uh, how could I skip that? Okay. Let me up. And then. Into the wind. How's the pop? Ah, oh, frickity frack dickity dack. Are you serious? <laughs> no. No. Someone, please help me! Uh, isn't this a statue? Isn't that just Oz? Don't refer to me like that. My name is Leon. Leon and Kennedy? I am a knight of the Immanoctrag. Resident a Evil? Knight? Wrong but universe. You don't look like one. You can't tell. Anyway, please don't speak ill of Sire Osvaldo. He personally designed and distributed the armor for Denoct Raven Ritter. Well, you must have heard that one before, surely. Oz's his full name, Osvaldo Hofnavines. Dear friends, I apologize for interrupting your lovely conversation, but I believe you haven't been informed that the gate ahead has been locked. Yep, that's news to us! I'm hoping you'll be kind enough to save me, and in exchange, I'll gladly teach you how to unlock the gate. Well, I guess we'll have to save you then. <laughs> what? They see me rolling. Valiant heroes, no words can express how grateful I feel right now. Thank you very much. Remember, this is the password that unlocks the gate. May my people be freed from the shackles of ancient decrees. May the people decrees and be free. What? What the heck? May my people be freed from the shackles of ancient decrees. <laughs> Why what? Oh jeez, okay. The great secretaire, the lords, and the devoted Natraben Ritter mounted the tower to pledge their allegiance to the princessin, kissing the hem of her exquisite purple dress and taking pride in their loyalty. Don't mind me, just admiring Hazel. Looks like it's a dead end ahead. There's only a book! Do you think what we just heard is the story from the book? So the Holy Land in the book's title refers to the Immanokreish. This book sings the praises of the princess from the perspective of the people in her kingdom. We're on the last page of the book, but the story doesn't seem to have ended. What happens next? Paimon wants to know what happens next! I guess we'll have to keep exploring. As for this book... Wait, I have an idea. Now that we've finished it, let's close it. Just close it? Oh, now we're out of the domain, all right. Huh? Oh. We've been transported again, but we're not back on the beach. <gasps> Fish we are lore. somewhere in... Mondstadt. Greetings, Honorable Kaiserin Dover Ertelung. Amy, dear. I've made steak and fisherman's toast. Come on, eat up before they go cold. <sighs> Mother... Oh, look at me being so forgetful. Ahem. <clears throat> Dost thou knowest, Princessin der Verurtalang, that the hour of luncheon encroaches? Of course, mother. Ah, behold the view from the window, a delight to the senses. Princessin Kaiserin, would you care to join the Kaiser der Verurtalang for a grand royal picnic? We shall enjoy the scenic view and partake of the delicacies granted to us by the heavens. I shall gladly join you. Uh, uh, Me too. <laughs> oh. Uh, does anyone want to say anything about that? Uh, that's not. <laughs> okay, I'll bite. So, Amy, that's Fischl's real name? Seems like it. The other two voices were probably her mom and dad. Why are you all giving me that look? Forgive me if this comes across as rude, but is your surname truly Magistus? 
Huh. You think I was bluffing? My full title is and always has been Mona Magistus the Astrologist. Oh, my apologies. Baby. Don't you think that's a bit long? Well, it's a special Twice. case. Only geniuses get titles like this. Well, that makes no sense. What are your thoughts on the scenes we just witnessed? Well, it seems that closing the book is one way of affecting change in this mirage. Well, I think it's sweet that Fischl's parents are willing to play along with her. Well, they probably didn't indulge her forever. Based on the voice, this was surely a memory from her childhood. It's a different story now she's grown up. You know a lot about Fischl, Mona. After all, we've been friends for quite a while. Speaking of... I wonder where Fischl is now. That voice mentioned that she was heading out. We may as well go outside and see if we can find anything. Oh, we're back! Wait, why are we back? We haven't finished the story yet! This feels as awful as purchasing a counterfeit astrology tutorial or realizing you've forgotten your wallet in the middle of dinner. Oh. Oh, this is torture. I think they're a little bit upset. <laughs> to be honest, I also don't like to read books that end on an unexpected cliffhanger. <laughs> no one likes that. <clears throat> <laughs> All right, let's enter the mirage again. Good idea! Let's go! You can't... Huh? Mm. <laughs> You're it. We're still here. It's not working. Maybe Fischl's not Is that we were able to enter earlier, monster? But now How is can't. this body doing there? Why? Why are we being denied the opportunity to finish the book? This is pure sadism. Hmm. Maybe it's because we've already reached the end of this book. Before leaving the Mirage, we saw that the book had been flipped to the final page. I believe him of the Holy Land is divided into multiple volumes. It's like one of those sneaky light novel marketing schemes. If you want to know what happens next, please buy the next volume. Ugh. I have to see the ending. Oh, oh, y yes, the ending. Everyone wants to know how the book ends. Huh? Who's there? Oh, oh, sh heavens above, she saw me. Stand up straight, stand up straight. You're... Leon? I'm... Ask me for directions, oh. Arnold. Arnold? That name's a little on the nose. So, Arnold, let me ask you something. I did it. It's ask me for directions, Jeez. Arnold. Jeez, Louise. So, ask me for directions, Arnold. Let me ask you something. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Are there other volumes of Hymn of the Holy Land? Where can I find them? Oh, ho, ho. you're asking the right person. Hymn of the Holy Land is the sacred scripture of the Immernachreich. There are three volumes in total, with the other two stored in two high locations in the castle. If you wish to find the second volume, you must climb to the very top floor of the tower. Tower? You mean that tower over there? That is, indeed, the tower where the sacred scripture is stored. If you look closely to the cave right over there, you'll find a secret passage that will swiftly take you to the tower. Okay. Thank you, Arnold. It's Ask Me for Directions, Arnold. Do you have any other questions for me, Fair Maiden? Concerning, perhaps, my relationship status or monthly income? The heck? <laughs> no! Goodbye. He chanted. <laughs> Let's ignore that, Raven, and proceed. He chanted. There's a flirt. secret passage in the cave ahead that leads directly to the top of the tower. Oh, oh, but, ma'am, are you sure you're not interested in me? I only shared with you the secrets of the Immernachreich because of your great beauty. Hey, no way does Burp try, try on Mona to act. Mona Majestus? Oh, that's cringe. Oh. Why did the lady appear so irritated? Did I say something inappropriate? Oh, what must I do to win her heart? That's not. <laughs> hey, stop. Who are you? 
Explain yourselves. What's your purpose here? This place even comes with guards! Uh, what are you doing? How can you prove that you are Her Highness's retainers? <laughs> Such an absurd question betrays your ignorance. May my people be freed from the shackles of ancient decrees. Th that's the password of the Imanat Rice! They really are Her Highness's retainers! That was easy. Oh my goodness, we didn't know. Please, forgive us. <laughs> oh my goodness. Now step down! Y yes, we're leaving now. They're gone. This is the second volume of Hymn of the Holy Land. Everyone ready? Yep. Bring it on! Uh, I did not mean to climb on that. I am so sorry, Fischl. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, that was disrespectful. However, the Immer oh. Nachtreich soon oh, became funny. plagued by a perpetual nightmare. Tasrak, the wicked dragon, infiltrated the subterranean, crossed the bottom of the sea, and eventually came to roam above the capital. Huh? A dragon? The only thing I notice is gloomy weather. Could the dragon be some kind of metaphor? If that's so... Her arch-nemesis Tasrak, the Wicked Dragon, is made up of everything that opposes her and rejects her fantasies. Can I just cheat? <laughs> okay, what is blocked? Can I just cheat? I, 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 I don't- I actually like don't have the energy to do all these. So... <laughs> Burst forth! <laughs> Into the wind. <laughs> I'm a genius. What's this? Oh. Oh. Hoo -hoo. Woo. The heck am I supposed to do? Oh. I don't get it. The princess descended to confront the dragon, but the great battle was certain to damage the castle. You can drag on these nuts. Nothing. Okay, there's nothing to do. Um, this is Kazuha Albedo and Kazuha skill, so I can cheat this one. Oh, this. Ah. The game was like, no, use your brain, you pee pee poo poo head. You stupid. Wind Finally, strike. she pierced through the dragon's scales with thundering Fuck. retribution and spoke to all amid a downpour of the dragon's blood. She said, These nuts. Ah! Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh, Yes. I don't know what that did, but like it did it. Until it couple. Oh! <laughs> ah, I am definitely not going insane with this one. The mind, the brain, the mind, the mind, the mind of the mastermind. Help me! Somebody, please! You again? That voice sounds familiar. Is it that Nachtraven Ritter fella again? Nachtrawa? Oh, thank goodness. Huh? What are you guys doing here? You asked for help. We should be the ones asking that. What are you doing here? I see. <laughs> what in the princess in the Verantilog? Zoom in. Yeah. And then what? Zoom, zoom, zoom. Ton of vision. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I zoomed in. Nothing happened. Never mind then. Shut up. Okay, shut up. What could it be? Can't this bird go any slower? We're gonna meet it here, right? No. I'm sorry you have to keep seeing me in such a wretched state. I suppose I'm still not good enough to play the role of a qualified doctor, Ibn Ritter. Play the role? I'm ashamed to admit it, but I'm not a real knight. Rather, I'm a new actor who recently landed a job to play the role of a knight in a theater troupe. Oh, so basically be stars. That isn't really something to be smug about. Ah, well, you see, 
That's where you're mistaken. Theater is an essential part of Imenoctrag's culture. A fantastic theatrical performance is the greatest tribute we can pay to Her Highness. Oh, so this is your local culture? Exactly. <laughs> so I'm delighted that I got to play the knight. Why does the princess enjoy the theater so much? Her Highness once said, Celebrate me by staging a play in the wilderness. Bow down to me and bring me beautiful dreams in return for everlasting glory within the eternal darkness. I believe it is because Her Highness appreciates true art and can also sense emotions hidden deep within the souls of humankind. The crystallization and sublime expression of emotion is the heart of theater. People who truly understand theater always have a beautiful, sensitive heart filled with a rich array of emotion. Oh, so that's how it is. Thank you for your answer, Sir Knight. Uh, oh, th thank you so, so much, much for, for calling me a knight. <clears throat> so, basking still in this honor, I will be off to my battleground. May we meet again. Let's not. Hopefully not. Be more <laughs> careful in the future. <laughs> Upon my command, spread your wings and take flight. I want. <laughs> ah, the book has appeared. Yes. Greetings, my most esteemed father and mother. Today is celebrated as a festival in the Imanakreish, and I hope you can both spare some time. <sighs> Amy, come on now, darling. You can't be carrying on like that at this age. You're a big girl now. It's time to forget the fairy tales. Uh, but... Oh, and I almost forgot to mention, I've bought you a new set of music course books. Give them a read, won't you? You should dedicate your time to something more meaningful. Oh. Uh, okay, Mom. I, um... Uh, I understand. We're back again! I believe we have just witnessed the true nature of the Wicked Dragon. Uh, this is something I am all too familiar with. There are always people who believe that our passions are a waste of time. Huh? You're... No. Stop. Is it... Uh... Ask me for directions, Arnold. I came because I bet you'd be looking for the third volume of Hymn of the Holy Land. Well, you bet right on that front. You need not do anything for me, my dear lady. The opportunity to behold your beauty is the finest reward I can ask for. I shall give you the answer you seek. The third volume of Hymn of the Holy Land can be found on the top floor of the royal castle. Is it guarded by anyone? Oh, 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 oh. but of course, sir. It is a citizen's utmost honor to guard the sacred scriptures. But it matters not. I'm quite sure the fine lady merely seeks to peruse them and has no malicious intentions. What a shrimp. Your face is captivating and full of wisdom, and the company you keep appears to be heroes of some renown. I have the utmost faith that you will be able to comprehend the meaning behind the stories in our sacred scriptures. Her Highness's accomplishments were documented by Oz, the great secretaire, and became great treasures of the Imernachreich, I wish Her Highness joy and happiness every time I read those books. Is he gone? No. Oh, oh! What should I do? Uh, <clears throat> would you care to join me for a cup of coffee, good lady? If coffee is not to your taste, we can have black tea, milk tea, or hot chocolate instead. <laughs> if you don't want to, that's perfectly okay. I'll keep my distance and be with you in spirit as you enjoy a drink on your own. Your joy is my joy. <laughs> Stop! Stop! It's you guys again. You're violating the law. What's your problem? Pay your fines we and challenge the citizens' personal retainers. Cut the lies. Her Highness doesn't keep company with nobody. Hey, like hey, you. sly, hi, something, oh, something. Really? Are you prepared to take responsibility for what you just said? I'll say it again. Her Highness doesn't keep company with 
Who are these nobodies you speak of? Hi. Her Highness is Sir Oz. Amy. I must say, guards, it's immensely disrespectful of you to make such remarks to the retainers of the Imanakreish. <sighs> How dare you treat one's hand-picked retainers with such disdain? Be gone! But... Don't you but me! Hmm. You may consider that the case for the time being. What made Fräulein means is that it took us a long time to reach this place. She couldn't bear to leave you all here, even though she did not wish to confront this mirage. Didn't want to confront it, huh? <sighs> Sounds like Mona was right. It felt like we were peeking into your diary. Nonsense. Despite the existing threats, the unrivaled glory of the Imanakreish would not exist in this world if I, the Princessin, were the sort of person who could be easily swayed. What Main Fräulein means to say is that there are other troubles in this area. Troubles? Have you run into anything dangerous? Um, this matter can be revisited later. For now, let us proceed with more important work. Let's get this show on the road. The book's right in front of us. Let's not just stand here. Oh. I... Hello. What's happening here? Hmm. Majestic, but fragile. Vast, yet vulnerable. This domain both amazes and sickens me. Okay, anyway. There's a castle here, but some parts seem to be missing. Fischl, is this yours? Um, allow me a moment to reminisce. Main Fräulein, you may recall that this is the toy castle you accidentally destroyed in a moment of deep distress. Oz, don't say it out loud. Spoke amid a downpour of the dragon's blood. She said... May my people be freed from the shackles of ancient decrees. Such wise and compassionate words could only come from your own writing, main Fräulein. Hmm. Yet this kingdom appears to be anything but what I've described. The shadows oh. lurking behind the scenes are disconcerting. Princess and Fischl again continued her song. And the interwoven chords of his sacred words became the Immer not hymn. God damn it. Hey, yo, that looks so old. The sky is a lie. A hoax. Yes. The courage to leap. Okay, they want me to jump to my death. Roger that. Wee! saw, dude. I don't know what I did, but like, uh, I did it. I didn't. Mean, hmm, I don't get it, but I did it. It's just like how you score on. T I'm stuck. I'm stuck. What am I supposed to do with this one? I don't know how I did that. I don't get it, but like, I I I nailed that shit. How's the event? So. Oh my god. Remind me to not read chat while playing, my god. Sheesh. When the people worshipped her, she replied, Celebrate me by staging a play in the wilderness. Oh. Bow down to me and bring me beautiful dreams in return for everlasting glory within the eternal dark. Precious. Mm, they don't give me a pre gems. That's a support. Is that it? Yeah! She Give picked me. up mere stones to carve out mountains and oceans before bestowing upon her people castles and towns. My magnificent kingdom is a small and forbidden paradise. That sounds like a happy ending to Paimon! Yes, to Paimon, which means it's not. What? 
What is there to adjust? I don't get it. Just move it around. A wee. Man, you're right. You're right. Uh, help me! Oh my god, not again. Are you serious? I can assure you that this will definitely be the last time. Press F to doubt. Ugh, the things I do for the bird. Ah, 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 ah. Fella, if you want to survive and thrive, you should be more careful next time. A successful journey requires perseverance, courage, as well as a keen sense of danger. You have the first two, but in the future, please strive to be more vigilant. I shall remember your words for the rest of my life. But it is time to say our final goodbye. Finally. You may not have noticed, but the weather has improved, and the sea has become pleasant and calm. You may not be aware that Hymn of the Holy Land is also a book of prophecies. Prophecy? A pine Sacred scripture. Yes, it is. Hundreds of years ago, the Imanacht Reich was engulfed by a menacing shadow. But our ruler stood by and Wait, well, notice something? The way they pronounce Imanachtrai is so in ruling the kingdom. It's different. Some of them pronounce it as Imanachtrai. The great secretary appeared And then Imanachtrai. He brought us the sacred what? scriptures and a most encouraging prophecy. That prophecy is just as it's described in the book and predicts a blessed future for the Imanacht Reich. As a result, Not we became convinced that the gloomy skies would eventually clear, and we have been eagerly awaiting for that blessed day. The Soteria, the Princess and Deverurteilung, she will eventually remember the paradise of the Imanacht Reich. And on that day, we will devote to her the plays that were promised in the prophecy. That is why I have stepped forward to take on the role of a warrior. I do whatever it takes to prove my devotion to her. Oh, I call <laughs> shrimping. Oh. Your, your Highness. I forgot she's there. <laughs> Hi. Hi, Amy. Oh, right. Yeah, she was lurking in the back when we rescued you for some reason. My citizen, thy will is strong <laughs> enough to sunder the wicked dragon's wings. I shall now receive thy blessing. It is my utmost honor. Thou hast done well. Tis almost most evident that thou dost possess the virtues of a knight. Go, take thy position, and wait for the performance to begin. We commend your unfaltering loyalty to Her Highness. Her Highness will now lead her retainers into battle against the shadow that plagues the Imanakreish. Thank you, Your Highness. And thank you, everyone. In that case, I will take my leave. Oh, by the way, please keep in mind that the password for the gate ahead is... Oh my god. Zian, mein Sommernachtgarten. Zian, my... What? What? <sighs> is there not a single one of my lords and ladies who understood my precepts? Fools. What Main Fräulein means to say is that you are all rather stupid. <laughs> Yeah, you didn't need to translate that. Yeah, I may be stupid, but that does not mean I'm smart. Oh, all the way. What was that? Ich sein, uh, immer, uh, mein, something. Zian, mein Sommernacht garden. What the heck? Does she know that? There's the book. Let's go and close it. Where? Oh, Let's there. Let's hope we won't get transported to another strange place this time. Nani? I am confusion. What is happening here? Library? Why are we inside a library? <sighs> you must be the arch nemesis I've been looking for. The useless and cowardly so-called princessin. <laughs> oh. How laughable. What gives you the impression that you can defeat me? You should know over the past few days, I've seen all of your fear and trepidation. <gasps> Why is there another you? Is it a shadow? <gasps> it's Persona. That's her shadow. That Fish shadow official. Aptly enough. <laughs> official, don't so worry. You just just accept your shadow. Me. You're gonna get a Persona. And that raven over there. You must be Oz. Excellent. I have been waiting for you for a long time. I heard that a great secretary named Oz brought the hymn of the Holy Land into the Imanakreish. 
I suppose that was you? At your service, main Fräulein. Why did you call her main Wait, why do you call her main Fr uh huh? As you can see, that's also main Fräulein over there. And if she is main Fräulein, then does that not make her my master? Uh, seems logical enough. I might as well inform you that the Imanok Reich is a place with no way out. Now that you've made it here, I shall crush you and make you my servant! That's kind of sus. For Oz, despite bringing over that hideous book of prophecies and causing the foolish citizens to fall to their knees worshipping that piece of nonsense, I am thou. Thou art I. The arcana of you. Persona. <laughs> Why don't you come over to my side? After all, Fischl is destined to team up with Oz. Main Fräulein flatters me. I see no reason to refuse. Shrimp. Eh? Oz? Where do you think you're going? Oh, that's... Oh. He's actually going over to the other side. Fisher, haven't you taught your raven anything about loyalty? I mean, he's a bird, no, so... this is not the time to discuss my shortcomings! Have you been bewitched, Oz? Why should you trust that she's telling the truth? Is not the Imanok Reich a sacred land of liberty and theater? You are gravely mistaken if you presume the Imanok Reich to be some kind of amusement park. Listen closely. It is a tomb for those who cannot face reality. You will be buried here. And I will take Oz, the product of our imagination, and live forever in the royal castle. <sighs> a tomb? Oh no, we going to die. All people should know about this. Why does it always rain in the Imanok Reich? Why isn't there any music in this so-called paradise? Because of you! It's all because of you! <laughs> How pathetic! No, dearest Amy, you, not I, are the one responsible for all of this. <laughs> you dreamed up a vast kingdom, but you can't bear its weight. Swayed by fear, you can't face the very world you've created. You may try to avoid it, but the fact is... You can't change yourself. I came here in your stead precisely because you failed to show up. The Imanok Reich is now mine. And it is not your place to tell me what to do. Don't forget to hydrate, guys. Amy, you are but a weak fool who does not deserve this world. Be gone. But Hey, are you done? <laughs> For you to give yourself such a piece of your mind... It must have been bothering you for a long time. Oh, you're not going to admit defeat, are you? Oh no, we're gonna fight the shadow now. <laughs> Let's go. I hate to admit it, but... <laughs> she might be right. Oh, are you going to accept your true no. self now? Please, do not think that. Your Highness, do you still remember why we came here? I am a samurai from Inazuma who's been entrusted with your safety. These individuals also responded to your call. Having your own tomb does sound pretty cool, but the Imanok Reich is not a tomb. <laughs> having, having to die sounds cool. Xin Yan. Oh, so you've made some friends. But do you really think that's enough for you to defeat me? Somebody doesn't know the Persona Lord, the power of friendship can defeat the gods there, so... <laughs> I am your fear, your dark side. I am your I true am the self. From which you have never escaped in all these years. Standing before me, you are nothing. I am your shadow, <laughs> the true self. No, I can't. I. I can't lose. Not now. I will be the one to claim victory. Just you wait. I will make you regret everything you said. Let's go. Oh, oh wow. Oh. No bless. With the power of friends. Oh yeah, I don't have Oz. Oh shit. Okay. Take it one step at a time and don't rush. You can win as long as you maintain a level head. Get it together. Don't lose to anyone and definitely don't lose to yourself. 
You ain't weak. That's not true at all. Yes, but like, it's not too late to accept your true self, you know, Amy, you know, you might get a persona. Persona. Loki! Oh wait, there's a ladder there. Oh no, no, it's not. That's not a ladder. You addict trash! He's a Magi! Oh, my divination attempts are working again. And the stars say, the official I know will obtain a landslide victory. Do a flip! <laughs> oh, found it. Time to accept your true self, official. Get a persona. I am Dao, Dao Artai. Impossible! How did you make it through that nightmarish library? Stand down! <coughs> Do you still think I'm going to lose? Persona. You! Loki! And yes, I did used to be like that. Because... I am someone who can't face reality. Who spends all day daydreaming and can't cope with setbacks or criticism. She's like me for real, but for now real. I understand. I understood as soon as I first laid my eyes on this mirage. Do you see that incredible world out there? So vast, so breathtaking. That is my imagination. The source of my power. You act so arrogant under that dark cloak of self-obsession. But that's not your true nature. You're no princessin. You're just a narcissistic speck of dust hiding in my shadow. You are the true loser. The one who's holding me back. Oof. <gasps> your fear. Now give it back. Oh, shit. What? Return to me what is rightfully mine. The Imanok Reich, the castle, my people. And most importantly, my companion Oz. Oh, main Fräulein, you speak with such eloquence and vigor now. You've truly matured into the princessin. You've got some nerve opening your beak, traitor. <laughs> no, main Fräulein, I've come here to prove something to you all. As we all know, Oz will always follow Fischl, the Princess Endeavor Ertelang. It should make no difference whose side I am on, because you're both Fischl. But consider this. When I switch sides, you did not lose your identity, did you? Indeed. These are words of wisdom. What do you mean, my identity? Whom do you suppose Fischl truly is? Huh? This is my question to you, main Fräulein. Fischl is... Well... Fischl is... Persona! She's a loser! Oh. A coward who refuses to confront her true self! No, you are wrong. Fischl... Is... Me? Ah, you caught on most rapidly. She's my true self? Huh? That's it? Yes, now get your persona. Indeed, main Fräulein. <laughs> Fischl is sometimes the Princess Endeavor Ertelang, and other times not. She may be courageous and arrogant, but she may also be weak and cowardly. Fischl is you, both noble and humble. She is a first-rate adventurer with few friends and the Princess Endeavor Ertelung, the sovereign of the Immanachreich. Fischl is both timid and strong. She's afraid of others' gossip, yet yearns for their respect. Most importantly, Fischl is often self-deprecating, beating herself up countless times, yet she always finds a way to rise again. Main Fräulein, no one merits the name Fischl more than you do. It's a complex yet simple name that represents the beauty of dreams and liberty. With or without loyal admirers, Amy will always be Fischl. You are Fischl, the enlightened one, 
who has always carried that belief in her heart. May my people be freed from the shackles of ancient decrees! Thank you for creating the Imanakreish and giving us a homeland, for authoring the hymn of the Holy Land in your subconscious, which offered us hope for a bright future. Please, embrace your darkness and return to your true form, your highness. <sighs> the heck? Oh. She got her persona. I am Dao. Dao or Tai. <laughs> oh. Oh. Woo! Oh! Fancy dress facial vanished! Wait a minute. And now she's back? Guys, she has stuck to her true self. Return to Fischl's heart. The shadow is here. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Persona! Everyone, citizens of the Imanok Reich, do you hear my summons? Yes, your highness. Ah! Uh, there she goes again. I am so done with this. <laughs> Oz speaks the words of truth. Today is a grand occasion, for it is the day that I seize back my heart and reclaim control of my kingdom. I hereby announce, welcome to the Imanok Reich! Let's go! Yay! <laughs> oh, that's cute. Oh yeah. One stormy oh, night, a girl found a way to the future in the library. Baby fish. She said to herself, "I shall create my dream kingdom. I'll carve mountains and oceans, and erect castles and towns." Then she spoke to those who shared her dream. Please be proud of all that is unreal, for we are greater than this world. Let's go! Our hey! magnificent kingdom is a small and forbidden paradise. Yes! <sighs> what a wonderful day. I reclaimed my heart and became the true princess and of Ertalung. The Emanakreish really appeared. Even so, I know that all the negative emotion I've been harboring in my heart will not simply go away. And that's okay. I'll carry these imperfections with me as I fight on. Because I now know that what I have is unique and wonderful. Fischl, the stage is all set up outside. Wanna go check it out? Lady Paimon, do watch your words. Oh, right. Uh, okay. Um, Check your it. highness, wouldst thou care to venture outdoors and, uh, check if stuff out? What? <laughs> <clears throat> How dare you, retainer of mine, mock the great and dignified princess and of Ertalung. <laughs> I concur. <clears throat> now... Let us rejoice and celebrate this historic moment for the Imanach Reich. Oh, what Main Fräulein means is that she entreats you to celebrate the arrival of the Imanach Reich with utmost zeal and great joy. All right, all right, we get it. Please don't translate her words back into official speak. Official speak. Uh, watching a theater performance in a nation like this must be quite an experience. As for the puzzle I'm working on, I should have an answer soon. What do you oh, mean? There's something we've got to do. Your Highness, Oz, please excuse us for a moment. <laughs> Very well. See you soon. Oh, it's you. Uh, <gasps> is that Clee? Is it Klee? Klee baby? Is it Klee? Huh? That isn't the tone deaf bard. It's Klee! You're right, we've never met before. Uh, it's not. I know you want to communicate with someone beyond the islands, but you can't do that right now. So, I cut off your connection. Huh? Wait, I thought that was Klee. It's not Klee. Wouldn't you rather find out the answer for yourself than ask someone else? The fantastic mirage represents the deep dream, the Who's most that? fundamental reflection of the human heart. 
go see for yourself. Witness everything with your own eyes. And when this is all over, tell me what you feel about it. Huh? Who? Who the heck was that? Oh, this is weird. How was she able to cut off her connection to Venti? And why would she want to know what you feel? <sighs> nope, Paimon doesn't get it. <clears throat> Sus. It's so sus. Oh, we're done. Oh, damn. I just peeked into my scry glass, and there's a new mirage forming on that island over there. And I have a feeling that this one is my mirage. <laughs> well, I'm sure there's nothing to see, really. Lady Magistus, are you embarrassed? No, absolutely not. <laughs> It's not like I'm worried about everyone judging me after seeing my embarrassingly pathetic mirage or anything. I would too. Honestly. This emphatic no sounds rather like a thinly disguised yes. I'm watching you. <gasps> Yo, it's beautiful, bruh. According to my scry glass, we've arrived at the mirage. Okay, let's find the entrance first. Is that it? some kind of pool. <gasps> Bath time. Pool party. Uh, we're not gonna have to swim to get in, are we? Why not? Do we have a non-swimmer among us? See you later. Hmm. Whoa. Oh. Hey, yo. What a spectacular structure. Though it falls short of the glorious Imanakreish. Bruh. One must admit that it is an impressive realm nonetheless, Lady Magistus. <sighs> At least it's not showing me getting lectured by the old hag. Thank goodness. Well, you read the lore. What else would you expect of a genius astrologist's mirage? So true, Queen. Okay, let's get started. I don't get it. But you know what? I'm gonna just unga bunga it. Should be fine. But it's not gonna be that bad, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Doing detective work means you gotta walk the walk. Yeah, we're doing detective uh, work, no, alright? I mean, literally. Genius Al makes a return. What do you mean it's a return? I have always been a genius. Watch me. I'm gonna nail this. Watch me. Watch me. Bam. See? It's open! Albedo main, Albedo main, big brain, big brain, big... Oh dear, what the heck? Ah, this is easy. This is like, this is like the Legend of Zelda. Oh, never mind. Oh wait, I did something wrong. No, I do not fit. Oh! <gasps> I'm a genius! Hey, there's a star over there! I know. And now it's gone! Let's follow it! Guys, I got a five star. Ha ha ha, early pity. Ha ha ha. Just one pull. Hey. Oh. That's it. Look at that. Oh! It's made its way inside! Don't mind if I do. Kobanga! I've always been very proud of my talent in astrology. As you should. <gasps> what in the... Is that my voice? When people discovered I could perform divination, they began to bombard me with inquiries. When is my missing son going to be found? Do they love me or not? Oh. Will I ever recover? Hmm. From gotcha? Definitely not. <laughs> oh shit! Uh! Being the honest person I am, I told them exactly what I saw through the scry glass. Well, that's not. may bring about resentment, I... I couldn't lie in the face of such a noble art. Astrology is a scam. Just like the weapon banner. That's insane. I'm gonna get squished! Can oh, you please oh, leave me oh, alone oh, now? Oh, I need some space. Ah, I can't do this. No, get me out. Oh gosh. 
No, that's kind of claustrophobic, the heck? I'm it not felt as claustrophobic. If I was being oh, shit. With but ah! lives formed by their disappointment. I could see the future. I'm fine. Yeah. Ask the challenge of the miserable. starry sky. What the heck? It's taken. I need to get hit. Hit me. Go. Join. Three more. Two. One. Bam. What? Am I not supposed to do that? Yeah, am I supposed to miss it? Is that what? Oh shit. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. Oh shit. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Happy New Year! Lady Magistus, this is heartbreaking. <gasps> Yo, is that inspired by Starry Night? That was really how I felt back when I first started out in astrology, but I've matured now. I'm no longer so easily swayed by random people's opinions. Yes, Queen. It must have been difficult to be misunderstood by others. I'm glad that you were able to move past that. Actually, there are many who have given up astrology due to similar circumstances. But I am a genius, so it's only fair that I'm able to accomplish what others cannot. So true, Queen. It's pretty inspiring to hear you say all that in an amazing place like this. You're definitely a genius. Yes, good. Keep going. <laughs> <clears throat> Sorry to interrupt, but the door is that way. Oh, we're back. There should be another pool around here for us to enter. Hmm. Oh, again. My girl and me met her father in the pool. I'm reading. <gasps> Chess. Sorry, guys. I have priorities. Hold on. The heck is this? Touch. <gasps> Guys, I got a five star. Uh, it's Sino. Oh, where are you going? The heck? Um, I pulled a five star and they went back to the celestial skies. Um, where's the clue at? The heck? Oh, it's there. Dude, I may have four eyes. That does not mean I can see at a 2020 vision. Uh, that's the base. And then there's some kind of a zigzag. <laughs> I look stupid. Whatever, I need to solve this. I must show my genius geniosity or whatever. Am I doing it wrong? I think I'm doing it... No, I'm doing it right. Uh, other way, other way, other way. With the left. I mean right, you idiot. South. Just go south. My god. Now wait a damn minute. That doesn't make any sense. Wait, is it flipped? Ah, okay. I think I got it. I think I got it. How am I? I'm damaging my brain and breaking my neck. Yes! Ooh! Let's try. Look, there's another star. Let's follow it. Let's go, Sino. Astrology <laughs> reveals the truth unreservedly, but not everyone is willing to accept their fate. No matter, running into difficulties is part of practicing the craft. I must also become stronger myself in order to convince people. I once met an adventurer on a mountain who also happened to be picking fruits. He was even kind enough to share some with me. So, in return, I agreed to perform a divination for him. The results were terrifying. I advised him to give up adventuring as soon as possible. Otherwise, he could meet his end within the next two years. Is he talking about the, the guy from the first event back in Genshin? I think that's what... Oh. No. I'm not doing this again. He was silent for a while. Surprisingly, he didn't doubt the results of my divination like others had. But he looked quite perplexed. I'm stuck. Even so, I have to keep going. Adventurers can't just give up in the face of hardship. With that, he picked up his pack and headed for the peak. Yeah, yeah, it's about... 
It's that's a reference to the first event of Genshin. It, uh, was it something something star something? I don't remember, but uh, I can't move. Heck, uh, I'm stuck. Oh, it's a maze. It's an invincible maze. Okay, maze runner, pop off. Oh. Let it go. Let it go. Is that adventurer dead now? <sighs> chance that he's alive? You know, like maybe you just made a mistake. You can't call it divination mm, if you reject gosh. anything bad and believe Three more good gems. unreserved. To contradict my own reading would be a blasphemy against astrology. Cruel, but truthful. Such is fate. Speak up and offer your highest reverence and blessings to the princess. Jeez, calm down, okay, for sure. okay, your highness. <laughs> your highness. Instead of making a scene, why don't you go collect the other fragments in the new location reflected by the pool? We can't enter the mirage without them. Main Fräulein, you are the only one with eyes sharp <laughs> enough to locate the secrets. <sighs> if that's the case, very well. I shall proceed to the beach. Let's go to the beach, each. Let's go get away. Oh, okay. Coming! <laughs> oh my god, that's hot. Huh. We've returned here once more. Yes. Indeed we Looks did. Looks like the story's not finished <laughs> yet. Let the adventure continue. Oh no, we have to solve the thing again. Uh, time to break some necks. Oh. Oh, ho, ho. no, 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 no. Oh. And then, and then, bam! <laughs> nice. I got it. Another stone. I did it. See, I can't do this by myself. I'm an adult. I'm an independent woman. I can do this. Huh? Stuck by the water, but didn't go in. Sus. Seems almost like it's waiting for something. Oh. Let's keep swimming. Let's keep swimming, swimming, swimming. Where the heck is the star? Written in the star. <laughs> oh, I'm really tired. Oh. Oh, oh. Mm. Switch. What the heck? I don't see anything. <laughs> Isn't that Ganyu's constellation or is that Chi Chi? It looks like Chi Chi's constellation. <laughs> Hold on. Uh, oh, I don't have a Chi Chi. A limo. Never mind. No, I'm doing it wrong. <laughs> Idiot. Okay. <laughs> Genius! <gasps> There's another star here! Bing bong. Oh my god, is this what you call uh, star cross lovers? <laughs> Bam. Go Bangda! Oh! Oh, wait, how the. What are we doing in my house? Oh! My, how unexpected. I heard Lady Magistus lived a modest life, but this abode... Look at the labels on these books on the ground! Only one of its kind? 990,000 mora? Hey, that's super expensive! There are so many expensive looking hardcovers over here. So this is what an astrologist's room looks like. The rooms are exquisitely designed. This place must be very expensive. <laughs> so Mona's rich. <laughs> hey, I'm just occasionally out of Mora, that's all. I never said I was a pauper. You're not? Oh, so what about those times I treated you to meals and had you over to my place for dinner? Fisher, you're talking kind of normally. Fräulein, mind your phrasing. Yeah, as I said. <clears throat> Thou oh my God, never mind. with the coveted opportunity to enter the palace of the Imanach Reich. Ever since I entered this place, I have found myself most preoccupied with that ornament. Touch. 
Oh. Nani. Astrologists are able to understand the most complex signs among the stars. And because of this, they are not allowed to show any arrogance. If one believes that astrology grants them unlimited power, they will face banishment by the stars. In the past, I was ignorant enough to think that I understood all fates in the universe. Maybe it was some form of punishment. But I became lost. You should not get confused. If you should become confused one day, not even astrology will be able to help you then. That's what the old hag said. We astrologists can't predict our own fate. But today, those words seem to carry a different meaning. Can't I sprint? <gasps> the bright shining light of death! Oh shit. Ah! I understand now that people won't always follow a beacon's guiding light. Even though the way forward may be dark and dangerous, they will still resolutely forge ahead. Fate is called such precisely because it cannot be altered. Is this Anconomia? Or reverse. Where's that figure? Um, oh hell no. <laughs> uh, I don't trust this. I'm gonna fall to my death. No. Uh, I... Oh, shite. Oh my god. I. Okay. Okay. I understand the governing laws of the universe and have glimpsed secrets between heaven and earth. Observing it is enough for me. There are no perfect <laughs> legends and no heroes that can save everyone. Instead of dwelling on my helplessness, what I should do. So, like, is there any chance? my own destiny. Written in the stars! Yo, it's so pretty. Starry ah, night. What a magnificent view! Lady Magistus, I believe this is the firmest evidence yet of your immense genius. You truly are the greatest archmage in the history of the Immanachreich. Stars like diamonds and the moon like a pearl. This is the most brilliant night sky I've ever beheld. To call up such a mirage, Mona must have a vast and boundless sea of stars in her heart. This night sky is incredibly beautiful. In fact, I might go so far as to say it's even more beautiful than what I usually see in divinations. All the stars are in their rightful place. The night sky of Tevat is truly marvelous. All the answers in the world seem to have been hidden within. As your stars move across the sky, they record all your life events in their path. And among all the people in the world, a considerable number will see their stars deviate from their path. When your stars are on track, it means you will be healthy, happy, and at peace. Conversely, if your stars go off track, everything will get worse. The starry sky in my divinations would never look as perfect as this. Some stars would lose their way, and others would fall. I wish everyone could be happy and stay on track. In this vast sea of stars, there are stars for you, for me, for everybody. The stars in the sky will always have a place for us. Even if astrology is resolutely rational, fate remains arbitrary. Cruel, but romantic. Now I will seize my own destiny. There was a transparent bird made of crystal. It was beautiful and fragile and could sing the most beautiful songs. But since mortals couldn't see it, they believed it to be a trick. How could a transparent bird possibly exist, let alone sing? When the bird heard that, it flapped its wings and flew across mountains and seas all the way to the night sky, where it turned into a star. Its brilliance was so dazzling that it illuminated everyone. It allowed all those that could see it to follow its light through the dark night, to sail through the seas under the guidance of the stars. 
It was born in wisdom, but trapped in ignorance. It has never voiced a complaint, for this is its destiny. Guiding people to see their destinies is the very meaning of its existence. Everyone, maybe we should go back to where this whole thing began. During our first day on the island, the Traveler and I checked out the Fatui camp together. We found a strange machine there, as well as some disoriented Fatui. The researcher who spoke to us claimed that the machine was just a Fatui industrial invention. He even promised to not disturb us. I wonder, is it possible that madness and mirages are two different outcomes of the machine's influence? If so, everything can be traced back to that damaged machine, except for the difference in how it affects people. This, I believe, is caused by differences between the affected people themselves. Oh, so what you're saying is, the device affected us differently because we are different from the Fatui. Yes, and according to our observations over these past few days, I think... The difference is that we all have stronger willpower. People with strong willpower will hallucinate instead of falling into madness. But those who break too easily can't maintain a stable mirage. In other words, we should go back to the Fatui camp and destroy that machine right away! Hmm. No, it should be repaired rather than destroyed. Why, though? What Maid Fräulein means is that rashly destroying a machine we do not understand may lead to more serious consequences. It would be better to find a way to repair it first. Hmm. Right. It pays to be cautious. Go with me. Oh, we're done? Ooh! What the heck? Oh, this bitch dead. <laughs> Everyone's gone crazy. Everyone should get out of here. <laughs> well, they'll never wake up. But I was right, my precious. <laughs> you are invincible. <laughs> <laughs> Baby, I'm not even here. I'm a hallucination. Precious. What's his precious? A miracle machine. Definitely not. Im Possible. I think he's referring to that machine. What a drunkard. Hmm. Goodness, the smell of alcohol. Main Fräulein, please allow me to fan the fumes away with my wings. How? Oh, you're gonna like. Oh, excellent! Please fan them away for me, too. Isn't that strange? The Fatui is a big organization, but he's the only one left at this camp. What's more, we didn't even see him the last time we were here. Even the larger gentleman from the first time is missing. I think they must be hiding somewhere. In the As vest. for why they may be hiding, I'm afraid we'll have to ask him. But, like... but he's as drunk as Tom Def Bard! Yeah. <sighs> Should we wait for him to sober up? Cleanse him with the Holy Spring of Punishment! Oh my god, I thought she was going to say holy water. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Main Fräulein means to splash him with water. I... <laughs> Ooh, sounds like a good idea! Let's Close enough! <laughs> hey, he opened his eyes! Uh, huh? Wakey wakey! Time for school! Hey, are you one of the Fatui? Can you tell us what happened here and what that machine is for? <laughs> Fatui? Ha! Fatui! Uh, those blockheads from the administration will regret it now! <laughs> That's what you get for rejecting my research and forcing me to... Forcing me to... To conduct my research on this deserted island! <laughs> my precious! My precious! <laughs> What's Gollum doing here? You mocked me! And my precious invention. You you don't know anything about the future. Oh. Um, calm down, dude. Only my invention can help us conquer the world. <laughs> okay, but like, there's a boar at the back. You know, we might get some meat. Idiots. Such idiots. <laughs> Ow! Don't hit me. I won't blow up the lab again. I'm... 
I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. This man's gone insane. There's no way we can communicate with him. Man went cuckoo. He wasn't like this when we first met him. It looks like the effects have grown worse, to the point of driving him mad. <laughs> My manuscript. My manuscript. Only that can, can save. <laughs> save who? Manuscript? Where is it? Don't yell at me. Don't yell at me. <laughs> Fischl, don't yell at him. <sighs> then I'll... <sighs> Let me try. Kind sir, look at me. Now tell me, where did you hide your manuscript? Mona! <laughs> no! No, don't force me to write a report! <laughs> look at me, this isn't you. Uh, he's completely lost in his own imagination! This isn't you. Allow me. Oh. Hmm. Please excuse me. <laughs> oh! I'm sorry! My, butt. <laughs> my brain is finally starting to work again. It's it's not a mushy mess anymore. That's what, that's Can kind you of... tell me where you put the manuscript? The manuscript. The manuscript is in the crack over there. Oh, finally! Otherwise I was gonna have it's to play hot. some of my loudest rock and roll in his ears. Kazuha hesitated for a long time before making a move. He's so nice! He's so nice?! <laughs> Men chose violence, bro! What do you mean?! <gasps> Just as I thought, this machinery, named Cognitive Mimicry, is capable of altering the state of people's brains. It was invented by the researcher we met earlier. His name is Persikov. According to the manuscript, the Fatui officials did not support Persikov's research. They believed he had taken the wrong path. But Persikov insisted on putting his machine to use. In order to achieve that, he disassembled the machine and used his connections to transport the parts to this deserted island. The manuscript didn't reveal any details, but Persikov did mention that the machine was modeled after the power of a god. Does that mean... There's a god connected to these dreamlike mirages, and the Fatui found a way to research it? Oh, dear. Clearly. Otherwise, they wouldn't have been able to reproduce the god's power. So there's some sort of mirage archon? Is it the Hydro Archon? I don't know why I thought of that, but like, you know, water, mirror, reflection? Anyway, Persikov's experiment did not go as planned. The machine broke down just days after it was activated. They tried to fix it, but the technologically illiterate Fatui soldiers completely ruined the machine. Even its most important component of all, the crystalline cores, got ejected and disappeared. As a last resort, Persikov went out on his own to look for the cores. But he was just a sickly researcher, unfit for the task. He had to give up. There's good news and bad news written on the last few pages. The good news is, Persikov managed to figure out the location of the crystalline cores by piecing together the snippets of information he could get from the delirious soldiers. The bad news is, Persikov failed to revive them and eventually succumbed to the device's influence himself. The last few pages of the manuscript are just unintelligible drunken scribbles. Hmm. <sighs> It appears that the responsibility for this issue now falls to my retainers and I. There's a map in the manuscript. The markings should indicate the locations of the crystalline cores. Oh dear. Into the machine. Bam. Oh. We've inserted all the crystalline <laughs> cores, Mona. Is that all we needed to do? I think so. That's what the manuscript says, anyway. Let's give it some time. Hopefully, it'll return to normal.
Well, we did all the work. What do you We're think? We're the ones who fixed the machine. Yeah, you're welcome. Yeah, we that could have she had said. a nice relaxing vacation if all of this hadn't ended up occupying so much of our time. Hmm. Apologize to me and my retainers at once. Uh-huh. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm out of here. Heck. Hey, hey. Don't leave me here on my own. Mr. Persikoff's still there. We need to save him. <laughs> Those two definitely seem a little more lucid now. It looks like we succeeded. Yay! Let's get out of here then! Paimo wants to spend the rest of this vacation back at our own camp. You mean Klee's camp? Yeah, but it feels like our camp now. Kind of like our temporary home. <laughs> then perhaps we should call it the Embassy of the Imanakreish and Dodo Land. Oh. Huh? No! <laughs> Invited you all here not only to witness the arrival of our holy land, but most importantly, she wished that you could all relax and enjoy the summer. Great! Well, uh -huh. I've come to the right place. I love it here. May this place become an eternal paradise. Main Fräulein says she hopes to go on more adventures with you here in the Traveler. I have a suggestion. Yes. There's a snack called roasted lavender melon in Inazuma, which goes rather well with fish. Why don't we roast some fruit and seafood for dinner tonight? We had that with Shinobu and Arataki Ito. Oh? Did you try it in Inazuma? A few Inazuma friends made some for me. Yeah. Yeah. As I said. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> You're so adorable. You know? I want to follow your example and travel around the world. Hopefully, I can also make good friends along the way. Knowing you, that shouldn't be a problem. That means a lot coming from you. Ah, you're all here. Hi, wife. I've noticed an issue. Oh, no. Although we fixed the machine, as you can see, the mirages on the islands have still not disappeared. Hmm, I've noticed that too. But considering it took some time for the mirages to appear, it may also take some time for them to disappear. Yeah, it's gonna take a yes, month. Yes, that's definitely possible. In other news, my scribe glass seems to be working fine now. The divination results are also looking about right. Although... Although? Although there are some parts in the results that I don't quite understand. It's as if there is some sort of power surrounding us. And it's still watching us. It's Celestia. Do you think it's caused by the machine? Or perhaps Persikov? It's Celestia. It's the unknown god. Sorry, <gasps> I'm also not sure. All I know is that the power is not hostile at the moment. Whatever it is, it doesn't seem to harbor any ill will toward us. What? So we're gonna call the tone deaf bard, right? Well, hello there, strangers. <laughs> you finally called. I thought you were having so much fun that you'd completely forgotten about me. Well, we called you many times. The heck? Nope. Oh, tone deaf <clears throat> bard, a whole bunch of really strange things happened. It's very sus. You have no idea. A strange machine that can imitate the power of a god? Wow! <laughs> did you two have fun? Mm -hmm. We did! We ate a lot of yummy food and saw loads of amazing things! It was really cool! The point of traveling is to record any feelings stirred along the way. As long as you had an unforgettable experience, this journey has served its purpose. As for the mysterious voice, 
Although we don't know who it was, not only did she not harm you, she also helped you to gain a better understanding of each other, right? I mean, if she was able to intercept Alice's communication tool, I'm sure she's also plenty capable of attacking you. The heck? Just enjoy your vacation to the fullest, and don't forget to tell me all about the marvelous mirages when you get back. I want to record all these beautiful memories and turn them into ballads. Every summer will become an unforgettable song. Then I'll just wait for your return. Happy vacationing! Hmm. If Todd Deaf Bart thinks it's okay, then maybe there's nothing to worry about. After all, Todd Deaf Bart is still a god. We should probably trust him. Indeed. Let's head back. We don't want to keep everyone waiting. Now you have solved the mystery. Doesn't it make you feel happy? Satisfied? Don't worry, I won't hurt you. I'm just a little bird that sometimes flies by these islands and am now watching you from far, far away. I just so happened to sense a power here that has something to do with me. I was curious, so I landed on the beach to quietly watch everything that took place on these islands. It was fascinating. The ones who came here to work were so busy and yet I still saw genuine smiles on their faces from time to time. And then all of you arrived later on, bringing your glorious dreamscapes and wonderful willpower. Your dreams are like the pure and delicate bubbles floating on the water. The more beautiful the illusion, the more it fascinates me. I'm not able to travel myself, but I do admire free spirits like yourself. So, I helped them design a little something for you all. I hope you liked it. Who the heck? As I said, I don't have an agenda. I'm just a little bird. I stopped here to admire your lives, joys, sorrows, and all. Burp. You are a special person with a unique and brilliant glow. I decided to communicate with you in this way because I'm really curious about you. There's no need to wonder about my name. Maybe one day in the future, we will meet in another place. Just... When that time comes, I think you'll be able to recognize me. <laughs> Isn't that the dendro? That's a dendro. No. Is that who I think it is? Wait, 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 wait. The sunshine makes the sandy beaches here glow like the embers of a pyro slime. Oh, you can hear me? Hmm, how curious. That confirms it. Yep. Hmm, hmm. Is it a danger arc? Okay. Yep. Oh wait, where did they go? 